bei Divine Wisdom ganz. Quiet. Shut up. They have our scent. Run! Three thy way open. Blood show. This doesn't make any sense. Blood. Blood. Blood is the key. B blood is the key. What? I need two of you. Go. Go. I'll hold them. Go. So. It says the, the blood of the willing goes. Ugh. You gotta be kidding me! Ah, it worked! We have to help him! He's dead already. Cheer up. Gold splits better three ways instead of four. It must be hidden here somewhere. Read this. Oh. By three they come, by three thy way opens, by the blood of them. Willing. Hail, hail the the creator. Ha! Oh, hail the daughter of. Oh no, 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 no! What about the coin? What's it say? This is forbidden. This is a summoning. I cannot speak. Don't this lie to me. We came here for treasure. What is this place? I I, I don't know. <sighs> Maybe, maybe it's a temple, or, or a tomb, or... It's a gate. Protects me. The divine wisdom guides me. 
All my past is brought to darkness. Guide my soul to thy sympathies. From the abyss, we seek thy salvation. By three they come. By three thy way opens. By the blood of the willing. We call thee home. Open your eyes. Eternal light protects me. Eternal light protects me. Eternal light protects me. Eternal light protects me. Eternal light. There is no light here. You came to the darkness for knowledge. And all the knowledge you seek is here. Surrender. Speak the words. Call her home. By three, they come. By three, thy way opens. By the blood of the willing, we call thee home. Sanctuary was never meant for humankind. It was forged as a refuge from the war between the high heavens and the burning hells. Instead, it became a new battleground in this eternal conflict. A secretive group called the Haradrim has kept mortals safe. But now this once powerful order is a husk of what it was and Sanctuary's ancient creators have returned to claim the hearts of humankind. This is the story of their downfall.
I should find better shelter before I freeze. Roads blocked. Should clear up when the storm has passed. Another abandoned town. Demons everywhere. Fangs in the dark. Gah! He bit me! Careful! He's a wild one. What's it to you? Oswen, hush! I'm sorry, Wanderer. You've come at a difficult time. This madman just stumbled into town and started causing trouble. Demons spilling from the ruins. Kill us all. Kill us all. Ruins? What is he talking about? Come, I'll explain. There is evil staring in the ruins to the north. That poor monk back there must have gone inside. Even a holy man like him was driven mad by whatever he saw. These will keep you safe. Wh what's that? Y you say something? Greetings. Oh, you poor thing. Traveling in this awful weather. Fire's looking good. But I should watch it a little longer. To make sure it doesn't go out. If Devmir's taking up all the space by the fire, just give him a shove. <laughs> Let me help you out. A warm heart. There are still things to be grateful for in this world. I'm sorry, it's a bit cramped. It's still better than a cave. Alenta went a bit deaf last winter. You might need to speak up around her. Ah, uh, nothing special about our little town, but it's home. We'll do what we can for him. Might have to keep him in the shed for now, though. He tried to bite off Oswin's fingers. Could you protect us from whatever is out there? We have nowhere else to turn. There is evil lurking in those ruins. I will drag it into the light of day. Truly? Oh, thank you. Hello. The old ruins are clear. Your town should be safe now. Truly! Ha! Huh. By the light, you are heaven sent! Oh, I'm so sorry. We, we haven't any coin to offer. But we have hot stew, good company, and... Stay for a pint. Wash out the taste of the stew! <laughs> <laughs> We'd be honored if you'd join us. To our savior! <laughs> <laughs>
mother's blood, my mother's body. So uh, shall you witness her glory before you die. <laughs> Get up! Get up! We have to fight our way out! There! Take them! May the light preserve us. Lost souls! All of you! are courting pain and death. Heretics drugged me after I returned from the ruins, just like you. I came to my wits and escaped, tried to get inside the chapel, but it was locked and... <coughs> what manner of evil is this? Petals? Of blood? <sighs> They... they must have fed them to me. A blasphemous ritual. How did they learn this? Perhaps the answer lies in the chapel. They kept it locked up for a reason. The key might be on that woman who was leading them. The ones I was fed. Is this real?
shameful. Our father has granted you a path to salvation. <clears throat> and yet you stray from it at every opportunity. You drink and gamble. You covet and steal. Shameful. Sin is their birthright. <gasps> My children, the lords of hell are coming to devour our world. Salvation lies not in the light, but in you. The faith has taught you to deny your heart's desire and turned you into a prisoner within yourself. Break the chains and discover who you were meant to be. Break the chains and be beautiful in sin. Vani, it's me. I brought your child into this world. the dry steps and continue your preparations. Now our true work begins. Uh, you came to thank the light. Looking for the town priest. He stopped sending tithes, and I came to find out why. As I neared the village, I sensed darkness around the ruins. I went to investigate, found the priest's body. Demons. Foolishly, I took shelter in Nevesk and ate their food. You know the rest. You collapsed inside. I thought that darkness had swallowed you. I dragged you here and put this cursed place to the torch. What happened to you in there? I saw a vision. A horned demon. She said the lords of hell are coming. She wanted to help the people survive. Help them? She called them her children. And they welcomed her like a mother. Mother? No. It cannot be. I must report to the cathedral. Listen, there is a hermit to the northeast. A man of questionable loyalty. But he knows of the forbidden. He might be useful to us. Bring him to the cathedral in Kiovashad, and you will be in the light's favor. Do not call her that. It is a demon, Lilith. The Gospel says that she will walk among the people 
posing as the mother of sanctuary. If she is here, uh, it is humankind's own sin that has brought her. He surrounds himself with dark knowledge. Tread carefully, and pray he has not fallen to Lilith as well. Goodbye. Is he hiding back here? Short fangs. Young. Freshly turned. An easy kill. Further south than the others. They're spreading. to join me for supper. I'm bloody hungry. That's quite the story. I wish it wasn't true, but it is. Why did I have that vision? Thank those friendly villagers. They gave you the blood of Lilith. The blood of a demon. Not just any demon. The daughter of hatred. The mother of sanctuary. She was banished ages ago. But this world is her creation. It was prophesied she would come back. What does she want? That's the question. Sanctuary has always been trapped amid the eternal conflict. A war between angels and demons. But Lilith serves neither side. She has her own plans for us. And me? Am I corrupted? Not sure yet. But you two share a connection. What will you do about it? Use it. Find out what she's after. Good. Then we're in this together. Rest while you can. Then we'll start in Kiovashad. If we can't stop Lilith, we'll all be damned. Close to the city. Let's see who is spreading. Never thought I'd live to see all this. The Angel in Arius. I'm sure you've heard the Cathedral of Light babbling about their Holy Father. Well, he's real. An angel walks among us. And when he learns that Lilith is here, blood will flow. They are ancient enemies. They'll drag the whole damn world into their feud unless we can stop it. Let's not linger. Kiovashad lies just ahead. Hold. To enter the city, you must We first... have no time for this. Oh. 
To enter Kiyobusha, you must perform a cleansing ritual. It's a meaningless gesture, but some people take comfort in it. How dare you? Just let him through, lad. I've tried for years to get Lorath to do the ritual. Fine, but this one stays. I'll meet you inside. Take a piece of holy cedar wood from the shrine and inscribe it with the sin which troubles you. Then cast it into the brazier. As the fire burns the wood, so too will the light burn away your sin. This is a waste of time. Did you say something? Good. You must feel as though a great weight has been lifted from you. Welcome to Kyovasha. A man that old has lived through some dark days. Explains why he's so cross. So, what did you write on a little piece of wood? I bet you didn't write anything at all. Wouldn't blame you. Well, it matters little, I suppose. I'm off to the dry steps in search of that pale man from your vision. I must know what part he plays in all this. But first, I need you to retrieve something of mine while I finish my negotiations. A merchant in the center of the city has it. Just tell him I sent you. Sacrificing, summoning demons, honing all the wonderful gifts that Lilith gave them. The cathedral loves to go on about him. His imprisonment in hell, his valiant escape, his glorious return here, the world he created. But they never mention how being tortured in hell for a few millennia turned you into an ass. There was a prophecy, yes. It foretold the rise of the prime evils. The return of Lilith and Inarius. The doom of our world. Inarius adopted the prophecy for his own selfish purposes. Put it in the Cathedral of Light's Gospel. And made it seem like he would be the hero to save us. Cracked hooves. Sway back. Cloudy eyes. This poor thing is practically crowbait. With what you're paid, you're lucky she has four legs. Ah, so the old man's finally decided to buy it back. Knowing him, he didn't mention coin, did he? <laughs> if he wants his weapon, you will need to pay. Wait. The old man sold me this too. Said he didn't need it anymore, but I think he'd want it back all the same. No charge. I appreciate that. Ah, 
Apologies. He also gave me this amulet. What is it? The mark of the Haradrim. An ancient order of scholars and mages, sworn to protect sanctuary from demons. These days, we are few in number. There is another Haradrim, Donan. His breadth of knowledge about demons is equal only to his hubris. Sounds like he could help us. Hmm. You should seek him out in Skosglan. But don't forget about the cathedral. They'll be expecting you, and they might prove to be useful allies too. You're not coming with me? I'm going to the dry steps to find out who that pale man is. Join me when you can, just... Be careful. Your ties to Lilith, the visions you see. You are the key to finding her and stopping whatever she has planned. Sometimes our paths in life are set to collide. We just don't know it. Whether it is by accident or fate's hand, there is nothing we can do about it. The wanderer lost in the storm, fed the blood of Lilith, saved by a lone monk. Different lives and incidents drawn together. By what? Destiny? Or some greater power pulling the strings? I did not know. But at the time, I thought I had the chance to protect humanity from the daughter of hatred. The Wanderer's connection to her gave me hope. <laughs> Imagine that. Goodbye. Farewell. We were born in sin. Children of darkness. But the Father's light can be sought through penitence and faith. Walk in the light. We must be ever vigilant against sin, brother. Yes, Reverend Mother. Let the light of Inarius burn away wickedness. Let not temptation lead you from his holy radiance. Let righteousness sear away corruption and sin. Cast out thy darkness, for only light must remain. Cast out thine darkness, for only light must remain. Is this the one from Nevest? Yes, Reverend Mother. Did Lorath not accompany you? He sent me on without him. Putting faith in that old man was a mistake. What could possibly be of greater import? Lilith. So, you know. Hmm. We have received word from one of our knights of a demon sighting in Gale Valley. The description matches too closely to the sighting in Nevesk. If you would travel to Yelesna and take stock of events there, you would have the gratitude of the Cathedral of Light. I had thought to send Lorath, but... Again, he fails in his duty. With or without Lorath, the will of Inarius shall be done. Here, take the knight's report before you go. Reverend Mother, I received a report of a potential demon sighting. Horned woman near Yelesna Mines. Performed routine inspection, nothing yet. Sent in priest and escort of knights. We'll report in when we find something. His skill is unmatched. 
But as you can see, he's not so reliable. It's not out of indifference. He went off searching for a pale man who accompanied Lilith. So someone is helping her. <sighs> How easily the souls of men sink to darkness. She is spawn of a prime evil. Mark my words. Nevesk was but the beginning. She will kill again. But our father, the angel Inarius, is prophesied to defeat her. Where there is faith, there need not be fear. One of our flock, the watch commander, Vigo, sent word of a demon sighting. A girl claimed to see a horned woman. The risk is too great to dismiss. Seek him out. He should be well into his search. He was but a messenger, destined to pass on the word. Only Inarius had the wisdom to interpret the prophecy's true meaning. Story changes, depending on who you talk to. Some say demons, others say werewolves. Don't really matter, who means the same thing. Closed minds and idle hands. The cathedral mostly. No people don't want to admit it. Too proud. Don't want them here, but can't survive if they leave. <laughs> Probably better than it should. Hard times make people want to feel something. A little drink, a little gambling. Better than being scared all the time, eh? Ah, uh, can't you see I'm busy? Yes, the knights are not preferred, but they serve a purpose. One this town desperately needs. What do you need? Prava sent me. I'm looking for Vigo. You and that nuisance of a child both. Girl's been nagging us about that demon woman all week. Vigo's gone, looking into her claims. He should be at the mining camp north of here. All escort of knights went missing there last week. Along with the girl's mother and another woman. Watch yourself out there. More strangers in the camp. Are you Vigo? I was sent... <coughs> like a beast strode right past where you stand to think my mother's trapped in there with her you let my mother through sir shouldn't you be responsible for her safety but, uh, we have soldiers stationed inside you should be worried about them too <sighs> maybe you can help me My mother and I studied the Haradrim. We were onto something big. But then she ran off. It's not like her to abandon the hunt. Uh, mines are closed on church orders. They're not safe. Especially not for children. Uh. She did. The horned woman is the demon Lilith. No, that can't be. 
My mother taught me that name. You speak of the Daughter of Hatred. Did Prava mention me? She wasn't angry, was she? There's more than your job at stake here. <sighs> Come on. Let's get this over with. <sighs> the damn hoist is stuck. We've got to go on foot. Look out! Hey, that's my mother's charm on your wrist. Hmm. It's mine now, girl. She gave it to me when I let her and her friend pass through. Keep close. Maybe we should go back. Round up the knights. And leave my mother in Lilith's care for as long as that will take? No. I'm going on. <sighs> no lift. The jam must be deeper down. Locked. Over here. I can squeeze through to the other side. Wait, hold on. And there she goes. Mm, enemies approaching. Nowhere to go. Fight's coming to us this time. Open that door, girl! I've got it! That was... quick thinking. Sure. Why would your mother... leave you like that? She wouldn't. Or... she shouldn't have. I'm sure she had good reason. The tunnel's closed. We're... we're trapped without the hoist. Look, there she is. The way I saw her. Lilith. We need to find my mother. There, the hoist. <sighs> At last, our ride out. Oh, <gasps> slain. What happened? <sighs> we need reinforcements. No, we can do. <clears throat> What was that? It came from beyond the gate. No. The escort. They're all dead. <laughs> Over there! A woman! Vigo! It was one of the women you sent. Only... She wasn't human. She, she was... A demon! Like the statue. Claim she mothered sanctuary. <laughs> it was a dead bloodbath. The other woman, Venard, where is she? <sighs> she begged for her life. Well, I spared her. Let her deeper in. 
Give up, girl. She's lost. Vico, you must listen. Steel did nothing. Spells, prayers, all useless. Go to Corval. Tell Pro. Raise the army. The father. Evil itself. Mox sanctuary. Do this for me. He is dead. I'm done for. Your mother told me this trinket would bring good fortune. To think I trusted her. She bribed you with it, didn't she? You weren't supposed to let her through at all. But it's not too late. She can still be saved. Not by me. Not anymore. Prava will know what to do. You're leaving us? Abandoning her? There's nothing left to abandon. She's good as dead. I'm sorry, kid. He really just left us. It's up to us now. What is this? How your mind races. Yes, I am Lilith, mother of sanctuary. Daughter of hatred. I have what you seek. You hunger for knowledge. You dragged your child all over Sanctuary in pursuit of it. No, I... I taught her how to survive. Is that what you want to believe? Drop the act. You have questions. I have answers. I know the fabric of the cosmos. Everything I've read has warned me against you. You've read so much, yet know so little. Will you accept my offer? I... I don't know. Will you let me try? I want to try. Your mother is... Alive. She came this way with Lilith. How can you be sure? Sometimes I see visions of the past. I saw them. What? How? Lilith's petals. Her blood was fed to me once. Hmm. So curious. You are eager to know why you were spared. Yes. Do you have faith in me? I... want to. Good. For now, all you need know is that we are going to meet my son. Rathma, the first necromancer. He is that, and more. He is the key to my plans. It sounds like they're searching for Lilith's son, Rathma. Together. Mother, what are you thinking? You've mastered your fear. But I still sense your pain. You miss your daughter. My magpie. She's scared right now. She must be. Go. Or stay. It is time to choose. I... 
I trained her well. She's a good kid. Strong. She'll be all right. She... You've chosen well, my child. To reach Rathma, we will need to cross a lake at the bottom of these ruins. It requires a ritual. I will teach you. As you wish, mother. Good. You're ready for lesson one. Blood is the key. What did you see this time? I don't need sparing. Tell me. Lilith plans to teach your mother a ritual. One that needs blood. Your mother seemed... receptive. We have to reach them. Not enough blood. Never enough blood. I will follow you to the ends of Sanctuary, Mother. There she is. Nirel, you're just in time. Beyond this lake lies the necropolis of the Firstborn. A trove of magic and knowledge. I opened the way for Lilith, but I could not pass through with her. I... I lack divine element, you see. Stop. But I can find it. I'm so close. I simply need... Mother, stop! Look at what Lilith has done to you. You're writing in your own blood. My little magpie. She awakened me. She showed me things... I can't even put into words. Once I've finished, you will understand. I don't care what she showed you. Please, let's just get out of here. <laughs> oh, I see. Yes, clever magpie. Trying to lead me away so you can take all this for yourself. Hmm? This is my discovery, not yours. I will finish these rooms with your blood. Oh. You must stop this. Look at the gifts she's given you. Won't take what's mine. Farewell. You were... You were protecting me. I don't want to hate you. I'm trying. I really am. We're going to make Lilith pay for what she's done. So we need blessed blood. Go back to your prova. Get that blessing. Beg if you need to. Whatever it takes. My mother started this damn ritual. I'm going to finish it. Meet me in the Mistral Woods. Why there? The Haradrim hid a vault there. Finding it was her life's work. So much for that. Maybe it will help with the ritual. If not, 
At least I can bury her where she'd want. I need time. I'm sorry. Just leave me. I apologize. There's something strange going on here. Nerel must be nearby. You're stuck in an illusion created by the Horadrim. The portal will lead you through this crude trap. Relax. No harm will come to you here. Who are you? An admirer of sorts. I saved you in the mountains. You'd lost your horse and crawled into that cave. Would have frozen to death if not for me. Why are you helping me? Oh, it's very simple. You want to stop Lilith, and I want you to succeed. But you'll never do that by following the Horadrim. Their path always ends in fire and death. Why are you telling me all this? To warn you. A day will come when the Horadrim stumble. Don't be there when they do. The portal will lead you to that little girl you're looking for. Tristram, the Horadrim of old imprisoned Diablo, the Lord of Terror beneath the earth. And then they built this town nearby. <laughs> you can see how that turned out. I like the world the way it was, without Lilith. A little game of rebellion will only lead to chaos. You've already seen visions of the damage she can do. Yes, I know you were fed her blood. Do you feel it changing you? Perhaps not yet. But as long as Lilith walks in your world, it is only a matter of time. Thank you. Farewell. Back in the Haradrim's illusion. Nero! There you are! I think I've lost my way. The same thing happened to my mother and me earlier on. The trail to the vault ends here, so it should be somewhere around in these woods. The path is different now. The statue was the source of an illusion. We must be close. Finally, the Horadric Vault! Not what I expected. But let's not give up hope. All we need is one book, one spell, to help us cross the Black Lake and stop Lilith. Oh, 
sealed shut. What of the passage over there? written in Horadric code, and here, the same symbol on the door. I have an idea. You might want to take a step back. Chespeth Chot. Let's keep on. Shmada was here. Hey! Wait for me! The same seal as before. Should be easy enough to break it again. But why would someone use it here? One way to find out. Of course. We can't let anything stop our pursuit of Lilith. I'll open the door, and if we split up, we'll work faster that way. Only if you stay on this side of the door. Fine. What am I looking for? Don't you know? A book, a scroll, or anything that will help us cross the Black Lake. Chespeth Chot! Demon guarding that book. I should take this back to Nayrel. I hope you had more luck than me. Interesting. This ledger was written by the Haradrim. This is chronicling spells and theories created by Rathma, the first necromancer. That's not what we are looking for. No. But it can still work. There must be a spell in this book we can use to bring my mother back. She knows the ritual to cross the Black Lake. Are you sure this is a good idea? It's all we have. My mother will help us through. Meet me down there. I thought I heard something. Demons? How is that possible? It couldn't have been the Haradrim. They're secretive, but would never follow such a path. You mean that we found Rathma's book here, and Lilith's going after him? My mother told me once, there are no coincidences where immortals are involved. We still need a blessing. Perhaps the cathedral could help. You should visit Prava. See that the kitchen is ready for the morrow's service. Angels above. You've returned! The Reverend Mother will want to hear of this, but she's away at Corvalar. Seek your blessing there. Everything is unfolding as Inarius foretold. Soon, he will be free to escape Sanctuary and return to the heavens where he belongs. As a girl, she was sick, plagued by constant seizures. But Inarius healed her. When I met her, I was a sinner. 
but her faith showed me what I could be. There's no one better fit to lead us. One of our defenses against the prime evils. We fight terror with faith, hatred with compassion. We've built the mighty towers at Corvalar to withstand destruction. He was given a prophecy. Light piercing hatred's heart, it said. He knew what it meant, that he was fated to kill Lilith. And when he does, he will be redeemed, and he will ascend to the heavens once more. State your business. Reverend Mother Prava expects me. Open the gates! You were good soldiers. Worked hard. Fought hard. <laughs> Drank hard too. Brothers. Sisters. I hope you find peace in these flames. Vigo? What are you doing here? So you lived. I came clean to Prava. About taking that woman's bribe. Ugh, it's looking bad. My ass is on the line. Might not have a job when she's done with me. Hey, you're here for her, right? Let's go together. Maybe she'll go easy on me if you're there. Not many could bear your sins. You are courting pain and death. This is no mere armor. This is a holy vessel of the highest craftsmanship. It may uplift the repentant sinner directly to the light. Can armor do that? Faith rather than flesh moves this suit, though how is only known to it privileged few. The practice has been long abandoned. Something big is coming. Holy war. Mark my words. She wouldn't have asked me to prepare a relic like this otherwise. Hold. She's expecting us. Here we go. Good luck. Have the new watch commander replace the forces we lost at the mine. So, you've returned. Vigo here tells me you were braver than he. First, you will be made worthy of a blessing. A holy war cannot be won with faithless troops. Make no mistake, this war is holy. Lilith has brought the eternal conflict to sanctuary, and Inarius will deliver us as writ in prophecy. Until then, we have our parts to play. Make a pilgrimage to the Alabaster Monastery. Cleanse your spirit. Then we may discuss a blessing. May as well make myself useful. Come by the ruins, south of here. Hail. 
There's a shrine west of here. There's a relic. I'm told it takes on your sin, weighs you down, body and soul, beats the hell out of you. It'll cleanse you, prepare you to stand before the Father. I hope you don't have many regrets, friend. This kind of thing is a lot deadlier for some than others. Watch out, all right? I'll find you at the end. Nothing good. Lost more than a few worthy soldiers to it. But it'll clean you up for Inarius. Rare honor for an outsider. <laughs> if you can call it that. Ah, no. I'm not ready. Not by a long shot. Even if I could survive the trail, there's no telling what would happen in the end. You, though, you have a solid chance. I had my doubts. The priests were always going on about the return of Lilith. But now she's here, just like they said. Creature of darkness, for you have wandered beyond the reach of the light. Lift your sins, breathe deep the cold air. The path to redemption lies before you, if you have the faith to walk it. Let the ice into your bones. Welcome your pain. For the agony of the flesh is the first cleansing of the soul. Make your faith stronger than any hurt. Feel how small you are. Embrace humility. Accept your place in worship to the Father. For he has shown us the way. The end nears, Pilgrim. Look into yourself. Find your faith. Feel how it fills the void within you. Remember, you are nothing without faith. Hold fast to the light and remember. Sinner, but that bribe. Good soldiers died on account of what I did. Is that the kind of man I am? The kind I'll always be. I just. Damn it. I'm praying. Why isn't this working? Huh, you made it. That makes one of us, at least. You heard from Prava. I will. Soon. But enough about that. You're about to meet Father Inarius himself. Not everyone comes back, you know. You'd better. I, I owe you a stiff drink. Not sure, but I've heard crazy rumors. 
Daft old monk. If the unlucky bastard still lives, probably as cold in there as it is out here. It'll be ornate, that's for sure. Only the best for the one at the top. And remember, you are small, wonderfully small. No, 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 it's not about kneeling, it's about wonder. Oh, the light itself, divinity itself, radiates from that room. Though my flesh is cold and numb, my spirit is warm with reverence. What can we do but kneel? And so he was, until the sweet poetry of the prophecy rang out. To divine its message, he pilgrimaged deep into Sanctuary's heart to meet. Uh, well, I shouldn't say. It pains me to withhold the truth of his light, but I sense it in you, Pilgrim, so I shall tell you. He went to speak with the first of his children, Rathma, the prophecy's true author. He emerged armed with sacred conviction, a holy battle at the center of the prophecy to be won by his blade. He has meditated here for years and years ever since, readying to meet fate Head on. How do you know the warmth of the sun? The love of your mother? The beauty of a song? His presence is infectious. It takes hold in the soul. We are a void without faith, an empty well. The pious fill their cups with prayer. Mine overflows with his light. So near, so pure. I am changed. I am nothing. I am better. Isn't it beautiful? Choose to approach me. 
Forgive this intrusion, but... Tell me what you need. I must traverse the Black Lake. And that cannot be done without your blessing. If I've learned anything during my time here, it is that what we're looking for, and what we need, are rarely the same thing. I once thought I could find an end to this war, but there has been no resolution, only more pain. Everything I've done has pulled me further from home, from the place I need to be. This world we made was born from the impossible, and yet, like its creators, it rots from the inside. I... I don't... Lilith has entered the ancient city. With your blessing, I can pursue her. Your kind are weak, and this world has been wasted on the crusades of the unworthy. I can stop her. <laughs> this audience is concluded. No, no, no. You heard him, but you did not listen. His voice is music, a symphony of light. Look beyond the words themselves, and you will find truth. Blessed are those who bask in the light. Let our faith be our armor against the encroaching darkness. Ah, you've returned. Come, let us speak inside, out of the cold. From the Father's voice to my ears, a spear of light, piercing hatred's heart. First Lilith, then the Primes. He will deliver us from the eternal conflict. Vigo and I had a good conversation when he returned. He will do his penance. Trust that he is in good hands. Penitence. In the Heaven's eyes, creating humanity was a sin. They cast him down. Now he seeks redemption and the chance to go home. As prophesied, slaying Lilith is that chance. When he ascends, so shall we all. Yet you stand before me unscathed. I know his ways. That is approval enough for me. In the name of the light, I bless you. May the light flow through you and keep you from corruption and sin. Our victory is prophesied in the heavens. I'll explain on the way. Rothma's description of the ritual was difficult to understand, and the notes weren't much better. I think I know how to talk with my mother again. The breeze coming from the Black Lake. Do you feel it? Let's hurry. Mother? 
Rosa, please, can you hear me? Monitor Magpie, it's you. I can save you from this, Mother. I promise I can learn how to... Nere, stop. I can't be saved from my own mistakes. This body is only a husk. My spirit must pass on. And you must let me go. Mother, no. I need you. You need to move on, Magpie, without me. But I can help you one last time before I go. You have the divine blessing. Your blood is the necessary key. We have to go. But... Do you think Lilith is even still here? It's been so long, I'm afraid she's won this one. Besides, I have to... Take care of my mother. But it's not over yet. Not for you. Lilith was after Rothma. Find him. Learn why. I'll be back at the vault. All right? I apologize. This place is full of Lilith's hatred. You are the last visitor to my sanctum, though you come too late, just as Lilith did before you. For it was my father, Inarius, who arrived here first. It unfolded as my visions foretold. How we hurtle towards the prophecy's end. It started in dreams. I saw shattered images of the end of Sanctuary. The scales of a great serpent carried these visions. And so I went to visit him. My and the serpent's thoughts met, and the fragmented future was mended together. I put it down in order, and the prophecy was born. I need to destroy the tumors to go any further. The prophecy became my burden. There were others that knew. Ones that couldn't understand the nature of such a thing. I knew enough this would be driven to interfere. When he did this about him, he saw himself as a savior, piercing hatred's heart and hell. So I locked the gates to hell. It was only a matter of time before Norris would discover what I had done and come demanding the key. Savior. The holy blood in your veins should be boiling. 
Nothing you do will change the future I saw. I... I create my own destiny. And this prophecy of yours is just a small part of it. It is wider, beyond comprehension, of ungrateful spawns like yourself. Refused Venard's bribe. Nerel. Nerel, is she safe? Yes, she is safe. Our meeting is no coincidence. I came here to help. Will you give this to her for me? I should never have taken it. He's so dark, I have repented. Do you think I was too late? No, not too late. The light has come to carry you home. Do you not see it, friend? Yes, yes, I see it now. They have come. didn't need that armor to prove your worth, friend. I appreciate that. Thanks. Time for our roads to part. Farewell. Give 
give me the key to hell. I will not ask again. You don't need to. I saw a vision of the key lifted from my corpse, under the watchful eyes of the great serpent in my sanctum. If you are chosen as you say, it will come to pass. Is that Rathma? I don't know if you would have chosen to stand beside me in this new world, Rathma. But I would have saved your place just the same. And now, all that you might have been has been stolen from me. Goodbye. Vigo wanted you to have this. Oh. Oh. He was a good man. And Lilith? Was she even there? Did you meet her? Already gone by the time I arrived. There is more. I can see that. Lilith took a key to hell off Rathma's body. <sighs> then it was... all in vain. She's the only one who got what they wanted. Nairal. She came seeking the Haradrim of legend. Seeking hope. She found neither. But her part in things was far from over. In truth, we would need her more than she needed us. Didn't seem that way at the time, though. For anyone. Inarius proved to be just as unreliable as I'd feared. His self-obsession had driven him to murder his son, Rathma. And from the corpse left behind, Lilith had taken a key to hell. Where would she use it? We could only depend on ourselves to find out. Thank the light you're here. My boy, I... I think he's possessed. Worry not, Peter. The cathedral will not abandon you. Ah, good. You look capable. 
I could use an extra set of hands exorcising the demon that has seized this man's son. Meet me in the cellar there, and prepare yourself. You're about to witness a miracle. Colder down here than out there. A sure sign of demonic presence. Take my chalice and place it in front of the boy. I need to read through my prayer book for the right passages. The cathedral's normal method is to burn the person possessed. Some of the clergy can be eager in their reading of the scriptures. That won't happen here. Oh, praise be. <sighs> Father Inarius, as I shed my wicked blood, let it be purified in thy light. Let the light feel the darkness. Pathetic. This child belongs to me. Angels above! My son! Let the light push out the darkness hiding within this child. Father, force this demon out. <laughs> No power here. Never. I will never let go. His soul is mine. Father, protect this child with your grace. I command you to flee this body. No. No. Play it quickly before it finds another host. It is done. Mata, my boy, can you hear me? Please say something. <sighs> Father? Where am I? My boy! Oh, father! You're all right. Thank you, sister. You're welcome. I'm sure I will see you at the next service, yes, Peter? Right in the front pew? Of course, sister, of course! Let us give them a moment. Speak to me outside. You did well. You are more suited to this work than you think. There are many more people in Kyovoshad who are in need of me. If you have the time, I would welcome your assistance. You have good timing, friend. Quera here is convinced her husband is possessed by a demon. He is! Been disappearing all hours, coming home with bloody hands. He says he does not remember, but he was scaring me. So I tied him up in the cellar until I could get help. And help you shall have. Come, show us where he is. Hmm. The door is damaged. Quera, stay outside just in case. All right. Demons manifesting already? I don't see her husband. What was that? Vasik, my husband. He was 
hiding upstairs. He ran out there, quick, before he hurt someone else. Are you all right? It looks worse than it is. I will live. Go! There! Damn, he's gone into the sewers! Vasek, wait! Go away! Go away! Stay away! No, we won't forsake you! There. Careful. This situation is delicate. Like before, take my chalice and place it down as near him as you can. I'll keep his attention. Vasek, just stay calm. Will you save a little with me? No! No! Stay away! Everything is going to be all right. Father Inarius, as I shed my wicked blood, let it be purified in thy light. Stop! Please! It hurts! Let the light fill the darkness. No! Something's wrong. <laughs> Vasek! <laughs> Look upon the shattered remains of this poor wretch and lament your own demise. Relish your meaningless victory while you can. Vasek, uh, oh, I've failed you. I'm so sorry. We need to get out of here. I'm fine. It's nothing a one fire and rest can't cure. Thank you. As badly as things went, then I would have been much worse without you. Somehow, I must find the words to talk Vera about our husband. Take care of yourself, child. Walking before I... Oh, oh, it's you. Thank goodness. The sister is in the cellar. Come quickly. And thank you for trying to save my poor Vasek. I know you tried your best. The Cathedral of Light used to perform these kinds of rituals whenever anyone was in need. But it seems that lately they would rather burn the demon along with the victim. I still believe in the Father and his Holy Grace. But I couldn't let that happen to the sister. Not after she saved my boy. No matter what happens to me. Since she collapsed in my arms while telling me what happened... to my Vosik. I was going to find a knight penitent to help her, but... she pleaded with me not to. Asked me to hide her and tell any other priest that came looking that I had not seen her. Truth be told, I had to wrestle with that. Lying to the cathedral? Came close to turning her in more than once. But then I remembered that when I needed help, she did not ask any questions. She was just there, ready to do whatever she could. Well, she deserves the same. Perform blood rites. Exorcise. Demon. What? 
I cannot. You need my prayer book, but Jerez is lost. Need to get new one. Where? Margrave. Matve. He is jealous keeper. Be wary. He is suspicious. You may need to deceive. Please. Hurry. Who are you to demand such a thing? None but those who have dedicated their lives to worship may touch the holy implements. I am on a solemn task from the Reverend Mother Prava herself. Shall I tell her you are unwilling to fulfill her request? Oh, oh uh, please, forgive me. It is so rare to hear any news from Kyovershad, let alone from the Reverend Mother herself. I am honored. Here, here. It will need to be consecrated first, of course. Anointed in the blood of sinners. There are deserving brigands skulking in the caves to the east. Good. Now, take a piece of the burning wood from this holy pyre and place it in the blood. And do stand... Excellent. The Reverend Mother was wise to choose you for this task. The chalice is now ready for her. And... Uh, please, do give her my most respectful regards. No. Oh, thank the light you're back. The sister has taken a turn for the worse. Right after you left, the sister, she, well, the demon inside her is speaking through her. She's in terrible pain. She told me about the chalice. Here, I'll place it while you prepare. We must hurry. <laughs> oh. Come to watch your friend die. Please, save her. Father Inarius, as I shed my wicked blood, let it be purified in thy light. Let the light fill the darkness within all of us. Oh, your pitiful charging again! Are you so eager to watch me freeze your blood? Let the light push out the darkness hiding within this woman. Father, force this demon out! I knew it! I knew you were involved in something abhorrent! No! Stop him! <gasps> Stop this instant! The Reverend Mother will learn of this heresy! I will see you all burn! Father, forgive me! Uh, hurry, finish it! Well done. Light! Purge the wickedness! Uh, uh. Enough! I tire of this! Sister, no! 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 How is she still fighting? Impossible! Sister! Sister! Please! 
Please, say something. Please, wake up. Ugh. It's too bloody cold down here. Oh, oh light be praised. Greetings. Yes, you did well. The demon is truly banished. I'm impressed you were able to copy the ritual so quickly. It took me ages to master. Sister Octavia, you are all right. But these people have engaged in blasphemy of the highest sort, lying. Stealing holy implements, brutalizing a priest of the cathedral. They will burn on the pyre before the day is out. How could you be so rash when the Reverend Mother... Oh, and what will you tell Prava? That you allowed a commoner to so easily deceive her holy representative? That you abandoned your flock in Margrave and left them with no guidance from the lights? If I am to be tied to that horrific pyre, then you shall be there with me. <coughs> no. Uh, I... I suppose I have been away from Margrave over long. I should return swiftly. But, Sister Octavia, please... Take better care of yourself. The cathedral is stronger with you on your feet than in a sickbed. My friend, give me just a moment and I will meet you outside. You deserve a proper thanks. And thank you, Peter Quera. I know it wasn't easy for faithful folk to do what you did for me. Sister, you saved my boy. There was no choice to make. If we did not do everything we could to save you, how could we call ourselves followers of the light? Yes. I can already feel the warmth returning. Thank you, my friend. I put a great deal of weight upon your shoulders. I asked you to lie for me, to put yourself in grave danger. If you had rejected me, I couldn't say I'd blame you. But you didn't. You saved me. And in so doing, saved countless others I can still help. What about Priest Matvey? Are you worried he will cause trouble? <laughs> no. He will keep what he's seen to himself. Hopefully. I can teach the rest of the clergy to have a bit more faith in the members of their congregation. I want you to have this. It's not much, really, but I hope it brings you some measure of good fortune. Thank you again. You will always have a friend in the cathedral. I appreciate that. The nights have been quiet without you. No snoring. I can't sleep a wink without you. I apologize. Sorry.
is done. My husband, Theodore, left our home in the middle of the night. I heard him talking to someone, another woman. I went to confront them, but they fled towards a strange light in the forest. They have been gone all night. I think it's time I went after him, but the forest is dangerous. Would you accompany me? Story changes, depending on who you talk to. Some say demons, others say werewolves. Don't really matter, all means the same thing. Closed minds and idle hands. The cathedral mostly. No people don't want to admit it. Too proud. Don't want them here, but can't survive if they leave. <laughs> Probably better than it should. Hard times make people want to feel something. A little drink, a little gambling. Better than being scared all the time, eh? My sweet Fyodor, may you know bliss eternal. Fyodor? What has happened? Oh, heavens. No. No! Such sights I have witnessed. Such pleasure, such pain, I must have more. What? Fyodor? How is it that you... More! Please, go after that woman who did this to him! More! 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 It's no surprise Fyodor was born. But I have given only what was desired. <laughs> His petty soul has been torn asunder by agony and ecstasy, but his flesh is unyielding. He will not interfere. Farewell. More. More. You. You deserve much worse than the mercy I have just shown you. If it's a reward you want, take the dagger from his chest and leave me be. Specifically, the axe of the woodsman, a man who stalked and butchered travelers in this area. Rumor has it, the woodsman disappeared recently and left his weapon behind. The priest who hired me didn't offer much more to go on. At this rate, I'll freeze before I find the damn thing. Do you help me find the axe? I'll cut you in on the pay. Check the woods around town. I'm staying here where it's safe. I don't. Perrin does. He's a priest of sorts, but what he wants with it, I don't know. I've done work for him in the past. Always odd items or objects with a history. He pays well for them. Soon as the blood of the Lamb. 
have been a grim place judging by how much blood is on this axe. I confess, I'm eager to leave this place. I can't shake the feeling that I'm being watched. Now to get this thing back to Menestad and collect my due. Thank you for your help. Do not underestimate her. <laughs> A mad woman with an axe? She massacred my knights like they were children. Her face was pained, as if she could not stop herself. The axe, it seemed to feed on the blood. Someone must separate her from that accursed axe. The town militia won't stand a chance. They served as both protectors and... and as observers I trusted with my work. You... anyone but you! Stay back! This one begged for mercy. Now she feasts on human flesh. Hello. this come to pass? I need your help, and we haven't much time. We'll need to purge the demon from the blade before it can be destroyed. Meet me in the crags of ill wind. My study there is on hallowed ground. There is no safer place to perform the incantation. Woodsman's axe. I thought it dangerous, sure, but possessed by a fiend, oh, never would I have guessed. There is little knowledge concerning such a blasphemous artifact. I'll need to visit my study to gather my thoughts. I am Perrin, master of the Forbidden, sanctioned scribe for the Church. My charge is to study the great enemy in all manifestations. Magdalena has been in my employ for years. It pains me greatly to know what has happened. If such an artifact was found in the Vesk, I will see that town burned to the ground and the earth salted. Who knows what other foul things slithered out of that town? You made it. Let us move quickly before we draw unwanted attention. Here in my study, I have been permitted to research the occult. If we displace the demon bound to the axe, perhaps we can then see it destroyed. Take the woodsman's axe from the table. Place the axe in the holy water. There's no telling what the demon will do once we begin. Heavenly Father Inarius, let us drive out the demon in our midst. Grant us your favor so that we may send the fiend back to the pit of hell. Please, Father of Fathers, grace us with your holy light! 
I need time to prepare. We did it. The axe is no more. I know not what has become of the souls of its victims. We can but pray they have found the light. Look. Time for our roads to part. Can you feel it? <sighs> Eldheim is hallowed ground, my friend. Blessed with Anaris' holy light. Just being here is a way of lifting my spirits. I swear on my soul. I'll never take Father Inarius' name in vain again. Just get me out of this thing, please. Pray for me, Wanderer. I've asked Inarius for the strength to resist temptation, but I can't keep my hands from stealing. It's like they're possessed. I'm looking for a Haradrim named Dona. An old friend of his sent me. At this hour, I'd wager he's in the keep. Check with the guard at the door. He's upstairs in the great hall with his son. Keep it quick. I need to be out in the field with the other knights. Why the rush, my boy? You know, I, I found some of my old Horadric tomes. Stay here, and we can go through them together. I can take some with me. We have a visitor. Greetings. This discussion is not over. Is there something you need? I have a message from Lorath. Well, there's a name from another life. <laughs> Has the old man finally come down from the mountain? With a warning. An ancient evil walks the land. The demon, Lilith. And you know this, how? Did you and Lorath discover something of interest? Perhaps this is all connected to what you saw, Father. <clears throat> yes, I was just getting to that. There was an incident at my estate. Uh, probably best if we discuss it there. Go and have a look around for yourself. I'll meet you shortly, and then we can talk more. As for your request, get to Braystag. And be careful. Stay close to the other knight's penitent. I will. Don't worry. We haven't spoken much in recent years, but the two of us have history. We are brothers of the Horadrim. I'm probably the closest thing to a friend he has nowadays. Forging bonds is not exactly a strength of his, as I'm sure you've noticed. It occurred just the other day, in the dead of night. I thought it was a nightmare at first, but unfortunately that is not the case. I have some things to finish up here, and then we will talk more at the estate. Rothma is dead. I brought the prophecy to Inarius so he could unravel its true meaning. I never expected he would kill his son because of it. And now the very thing he wanted, 
This infernal key to hell is in Lilith's hands. It must relate to her search for Astaroth. Farewell. Welcome to Firebreak Manor, Traveler. I'm here about the... incident. Donan gave me permission to look around. Incident? That was all he said. I must be referring to his study. Something... unsettling transpired there. struggle to live up to your own legacy. What do you want with me? Astaroth. <laughs> She's dead. Astaroth cannot die. Not by your hand. What have you done with him? Away, demon. I deny you. You have grown so frail. I can make you the hero you were. Return to the darkness from whence you came. I said away! so close to the estate before. Perhaps they were drawn by Lilith's presence. I saw a vision of her in your study. What do you mean, a vision? I don't fully understand how, but it isn't the first time. Full of surprises, aren't you? No wonder you caught Lorath's attention. Well, now you understand my predicament. The daughter of hatred in my own home. She must be furious I cast her out. That painting on your wall. Who are the others in it? Why do you ask? Lilith seemed to leave after seeing them. The Fane and Arida. The druids who helped me slay Astaroth. Yes. Yes, I think you're onto something. I resisted her. So she might question them about the demon next. There are knights stationed in villages near the druids. If Lilith passed through, they must have seen her.
I must see to the dead here. If I'd known they were in danger, I would have closed off the estate. Damn Lynneth. She brought this on them. Of course not. Demons are arrogant creatures. She would never accept that our kind could vanquish Astaroth. What troubles me is why she's looking for him. What does she want? Astaroth was from the realm of hatred, the place Lilith once called home. Perhaps therein lies an answer. I'll have to ponder this more. They were like brother and sister to me once. But life has taken us on different paths. Erida is consumed with her task of watching over the dead. I long for a time we can meet and discuss old histories like we used to. And the fame. Well, it's a shame he's become so bitter. Lives like a recluse, deep in the woods. Refuses to meet with me. People either praise me or curse me for that decision. There is no middle ground. Druids like Nefane think I've given away their land to the Knights Penitent. What other choice do they think I had? After the days of Ash, we needed help to rebuild and protect Scotsglen. The cathedral was ready and willing. Wood will bend like grass in the wind when the spirits arrive. Physical barriers alone will not be enough. And your talismans and dirt scrolling will give the dead greater pause. Greetings. You picked a fine time to visit Braystag, Wanderer. The whetstones are singing. Hearts are pounding. Sweet music for a red day. Donan sent me. <laughs> At least you're not another night penitent. At least? It is us who will protect this village with our lives. Let it be. <sighs> there is an ominous fog uphill. Mad spirits emerge from it. They'll be here shortly. Are you here to help us ward them off? I seek a demon who passed through. <sighs> so, that's what it was. <sighs> well, this day keeps getting better, doesn't it? The demon went uphill to Erida's domain. But unless you want to join the spirits, I wouldn't go there. It's best you stay with us. I can lead you to Erida. Out of the question. I'll be safe. Donan puts his trust in this traveler. So shall we all. Tell me when you're ready to move. Mind what lurks in the fog and return as soon as you can. Donan will have my head if anything happens to you. She's a legend. One of the druids who fought alongside my father to defeat Astaroth. I was raised on stories of her wisdom and courage. The roads are thick with fog, so the fastest route to the hills is east, through the Weeping Cairns. They're burning the pine resin. I hope it will keep you us... You look like someone who's seen the world. I hope I can do the same one day. What's holding you back? My father. You've seen how he is. I need to be free of him and leave the bloody key. It's sealed. But there's writing. They look like old druid runes. The song of wind. The howl of... Oh no. They're coming. Hurry. All right. A-A-Le. 
เออาเลดูกรูอานิดูลานอเรดู It's a chant. The chant will open the way. Light, protect us. Hold them off. It worked. Something's rousing the spirits from their rest. We should make haste within. There's a spirit here as well. Yet, Erida's absence gives me greater concern. <laughs> this chamber. It's just how my father described it. You've never been here. Only through the stories he told, though none involved the restless dead. This doesn't seem right. Erida would not have barred the path of the dead like this. The spirits should be free to roam within the earth. Lilith. Strange. The door is locked with an earthen seal. What was it my father said about this? Wardstones. That's it. If you bring me one from the nearby cairns, I think I can open the way. Father always respected their beliefs and customs. It was important that I grew to understand his admiration. Whenever he talked about coming here to meet Erida, I saw a light in his eyes that rivaled any fire. The two were close, though. I think time has seen them drift apart. No, but this was her land. She was something of a scholar, preserved local customs and rituals. She passed when I was young, and, well. Most of what I know about her is through her writings. Ladal Hal El Oskal. Oh, that did it. Maybe this will ease the dead. It's a start, at least. Demonic markings. Lilith's been here. Something's written on the altar. By stone and root, by tears and pain, we bear this flame that must remain. Dead eyes stained with ash and ember, cursed are we who must remember. Ah, an elegy written by Erida. This, this is a memorial to all who died fighting Astaroth. The weak. Wait! We... we are not your enemy! Lilith... She must be bending these heroes to her will. Erida would never stand for it. Unless... Oh... Something has happened to her. We don't know that yet. Come on. This must be the cairn of the elders. So much... defiled. Demonic scars upon their grave and... druid runes to rouse the dead. These runes... the delicate touch. This is Erida's work. Why would you be aligned with a demon? 
I have seen others fall under Lilith's control. Erida was sworn to keep the dead at peace. What do we do? We'll need to stop her. Uh, right. Solutions are found ahead, not behind, as Father says. Do you hear that? Something screaming in rage ahead. That was one of the revered dead from the Cairns. Returned to the worms. May they find rest. Arlo, did you think we'd so easily join the dead, lad? How did you find your way up here? Through the Cairns. Through them? Mighty brave of you. And mighty foolish. Erida came through with a horned woman. Not her normal company, to be sure. Ah. Lilith. They headed towards Solitude, the top of the hill. The sound of Erida's Talharpa carried with the wind. And then, this madness began. If your aim is to follow them, you won't get far with all this fog. It seems to be drawn to the risen remains. We spotted others in the hills before this one tore from the earth. I'll stay here and protect these two. The fog is too near to leave them undefended. The stones defend us, lad. I remember when you were still a... I'm staying, Arlo. <laughs> Stubborn like your father. That will keep you alive. Much safer than stumbling through all this fog. These huts are more than just stone. My ancestors blessed them to ward off storm and spirit alike. When the wicked wind starts to moan, best to shelter in the safety of stone. <sighs> right you are, lass. I told them to stay put, but they all fled when the fog crept in. I'm sure they're safe. They know these hills better than anyone. But fear has a way of making the wise into fools. I'm a friend of his father. Met him in the days of Ash. Saved his life, actually. <laughs> if you asked him, he'd probably claim he saved mine. Hasn't come up this way in a long while, but he used to. Now and then I'd even go and share a pint with him in his fancy house. <laughs> That's how I came to know Yorin. I have enough food to last us weeks. Sharpen my blade too, in case any spirits get too close. You taught her well. Not so much to learn from someone like me. The truth is, she's the reason I've lasted so long up here. The roads are clear now. We need to get to Braystack. It's safer there. We've lasted this long and survived worse. You've been fortunate. Braystack. Swarming with those cathedral gobshites. Please, Arlo. Just for now. Maybe we should go with him, Dad. <sighs> well... The ale would be welcome. I will deal with Erida and Lilith. See them safely to Braystack. I... I will. Thank you. They're rising from the camps. Have you seen the signs as I have? Erida? Hell is coming, and my people are not ready to face it. Not yet. But you, you are already strong. Mm -hmm. Come forward. Oh. 
only one of us will walk away from this. So let's enjoy the storm a moment. Ah, nature's music. The dead are killing your people as we speak. Some will die, yes. But that is the way of nature. It is a crucible. It devours the weak and makes the strong stronger. And those who survive, they will save this land from hell. You've fallen for the demon's lies. No, no. This is my choice. Lilith only granted me the power to do what must be done. And what did you give her? All things must be earned in the wilds. Even knowledge. Prove yourself, and you will have your answers. Impressive. <coughs> the stronger prevails. So be it. What did you give Lilith? I told her of the wards around Astaroth's prison. How to break them. What? Why? <sighs> forgot what it took to defeat Astra. Oh, they must learn again. If they cannot vanquish him, how can they stand against the full might of hell? Goodbye. Time for our roads to part. And? She is at peace now, I hope. I... I never thought it would turn out like this. Heroism and sacrifice are often entwined in the course of fate. My mother's words. I must tell father what has happened. What Lilith has done. We cannot let her destroy anything else. Some of our finest hunters did not return from the hills. They came prey themselves when the fog came with hunger. Now their bodies lay bare for scavenging. It's wrong in all ways. They should be marked with charms of passing. The rites of the old ways to see them to peace. You are well familiar with our lands and as brave as those we lost. Could you see them to proper rest? Unseen. Unheard. We are always here. those held dear thank you amazing <sighs> my 
my torque of protection. I make these for folk who travel the hills alone. Keep them safe with the old blessings. But if it's returned, ere the said old death has meaning. But where is the meaning in this? They were good. Kind. No different from me or Dad. Dad says you can't reach the road ahead if you forget to mind your feet. So, how do you reach the road if you lose your feet? I hope she sees the wrong now. Though light fades, we do not disappear unseen. Unheard. We're always here in memories of those held dear. Goodbye. Farewell. The whole forest has gone mad. We're not going out there again. There's a horned woman in the moors spreading corruption. If that's what you mean. Yes. She's after the druids who vanquished Astaroth. Ah, that madman Nefane lives out there. We already tried checking on him. Got as far as Boglinstone Circle, and then the druid's wolf companion appeared and bit one of my men. I'm already short on knights. Not going to risk what I have left on some bastard who hates the cathedral. Nefane sees us as intruders stealing from his land, but how does he expect us to survive? We need timber to build, ore to forge our weapons, wild game to eat. Truth is, I think his hatred for us goes back to Donin. They were friends once, but they had a falling out. Not sure, but I met the druid once. I was riding through the moors, minding my own business, when he came up and spoke in the beast tongue. Caused my horse to throw me. I broke my leg. Hasn't been the same since. I don't care what happened between them. I'm just glad Donin came to his senses and broke it off with that brute. one of the knights. I'm looking for your master, Nefane. Think you could help me with that? Good boy. Lead the way. Lilith might seek you out. He was right. There is still time to 
crystal ball. Fear burn will accompany you. Hurry! Thank you. Under old boughs hangs the heart fruit, swollen with hatred. Let it burst forth and flood the streams and burrows. In this crimson cradle, let there be born an amalgam of rage. Let its anger ever burn until it has devoured the whole of this wretched land. Nefane's blood. It all flows here. She was already gone, and I fear she has taken a piece of you with her. A beast born from your blood. It's my fault. What part did you have in this? A pact with Lilith to help me destroy the Knights. Fenegent. In return for what? I told her where Astaroth is hidden. Held I. Why? In her presence, I lost control. Rage consumed me. to do now. End the corruption. Sorry. Time for our roads to part. Locked. I'll have to find another way inside. The horned woman. The beast. Nothing could stop them. Not our steel, not our prayers. <sighs> Listen to me. I must find Donan. Where is he? Some... somewhere inside. Dead. 
Like the rest, for all I know, the light has forsaken this place. Light, cleanse these faithful servants of their sin. Bring them peace in death. Bloody miracle you made it here in one piece. Lilith and that beast tore right through us. Could have killed me too. But she left me untouched. She's toying with me. She wants me to... Watch her destroy everything I've built. Damn it! Did you see Yorin the way you came? No. She hasn't won yet. There's still a chance to stop her. <laughs> but I can't do it alone. I'm with you. Where is she now? An old chamber beneath the keep. That's where Astaroth is. I didn't vanquish him like the stories say. I imprisoned him in a soul stone. It was a last resort. I built Eldheim over the stone to contain its evil. I spent my life watching over it, keeping it a secret, so Astaroth would never hurt anyone again. Not even my son knows. I'm sorry for hiding this from you before, but I couldn't risk a stranger finding out the truth. We should get moving. Follow me. If you didn't see Yorin outside, we'll search on the way. When was the last time you saw Yorin? We were discussing what happened to Erida, and then Lilith stormed the keep. I ordered some guards to escort him out of Eldheim. I should have stayed with him. One of Yorin's protectors. This night, he was with Yorin. Come, quickly. Yorin's mace is here. I told them to get out. Maybe he and the knights tried to stop Lilith. Could she have taken him somewhere? What possible reason would she have? He means nothing to her. We need to move. The way to Astaroth is through here. Lilith so eager to find Astaroth? I've been asking myself that same question, but I'm as much in the dark about it as you are, I'm afraid. They share a connection with me, a strong death. Astaroth is a guardian of Lilith's father, Mephisto, the Lord of Hatred. Here it is. The Soul Stone Chamber. Lilith has what she wanted all this time. She took the stone. No sign of Yorin, though. We need to find him.
mighty Astaroth. The charred duke himself, confined to a cage. What a pity. Daughter of hatred. I have an offer. You will grant me safe passage to a place I am no longer welcome. In exchange, I will give you freedom. And more. <laughs> Donan's progeny. His pride and joy. Your retribution. If you give me what I want. After I warded the stone with Nafane and Erida, the demon's power gradually seeped out. So, I turned to the cathedral. Eldhame itself is a, a giant capstone, blessed with Inarius' light. It subdued the evil below. It... It... None of that matters now. Traitors. They did this to me. To my boy. We must find Urin. As quickly as possible. I, I realize how hopeless this all seems, but... I've spent half my life studying the Soul Stone. I know its nature. It will take time for Astaroth to overpower my boy. I taught him well. Even now, he he's resisting the demon's influence. They'll be close by. Karagar, perhaps. Yeah. All those innocents to burn will excite Astaroth, make him fight harder to, 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 to take control. Lilith has what she wanted from Astaroth. Why would she linger here? I... I don't know. I apologize. Sorry. Kaina, get up! We have to go now! I can't leave without you! People are dying in there! They're... They're here. Yorin can resist. He's strong. You're in! You're in! He has been waiting for you. Where? Where is he?
Do as you please, Astaroth. I have what I came for.
Farewell. I apologize. Sorry. Shame about Yorin. Was one of us, you know. We'll take care of him and his father. Lilith and Astaroth had made a deal, and we were the ones who would pay the cost. Our presence was no coincidence. Everything happened exactly as Lilith wanted. We just danced to her music. Donan was shattered, his mind on grief, not her. Not answers. No one knew what Lilith was truly after, or exactly what Astaroth had promised her. But we needed to recover quickly, and we needed to stop chasing her phantoms. Farewell. That thing was Astaroth, plain as stone. Donan swore it was dead. That may be, but I saw him. I saw what you and Donan did for us, what he had to do to his son. It is a cruel fate for an old warrior to see his legacy perish. He did not deserve it. Oh, he will, will he? You must be the fifth person he sent this week while proclaiming his intention to make good on what he owes. <laughs> Aye, turn right off the hooks. In their hurry, they left blood on the steps. <laughs> Amateurs. Nairn and Tavish, local mischief makers, have also been absent. Sense tells me they are somehow involved. Man or beast who took it, the goose isn't the same without it. Tavish is dead. Oh, damned beasts. The goose won't be the same without him. And Nairn. 
They are why the goose stays open. Even during the hardest times, a respite from the darkness of this world. It's useless. Their anger will feed me for ages. Your efforts are futile. You will join them in eternal misery. in pain and death. Farewell. Well, he's still breathing. He is lucky to be. That old man there, he claims to be Horadrim, but he drinks like an ox. He came to town days ago, looking for a servant of the demon Lilith. A pale man. It seems he didn't like what he found. I see. I will take it from here. Who are you? He and I met in the Fractured Peaks. I saw his pale man in a vision. If you can believe it. Enough. He's yours. Just keep away from the bottle, both of you. Greetings. Oh, bloody damn elves, what do you want? You told me to meet you here, Lorath. Remember? Of course I remember. I'm just surprised you're not dead. Hand me that bottle. What happened to you? I was attacked, obviously, by vast quantities of alcohol, wielded by my own treacherous hand. <sighs> there may also have been a brawl with the goats over this patch of mud, but I like to think I triumphed. Lorath, who is the pale man? The Pale Man is, or was, Haradrim. Haradrim? Then you must know him. I thought I did, once. His name is Elias. He was my apprentice. He was the one who brought Lilith to Sanctuary. 
It's possible that I did not take the news very well. What must we do then? Find him. Figure out what he's done. And then kill him. Listen. There's a woman here someplace. She has some messages we'll need. And I'm of no use to anyone right now. Could you find her? Enough time has been wasted. Oh, check around the inn. Ask if she's heard from the Orbe Monastery. Impressive. <sighs> no, no word from Orbe. Same as yesterday and the day before. But I have something else. Rumor has it a pale man passed through the Abaru Canyon some time ago. Fearsome fellow, dressed in black. After Laura's performance last night, I wager he'll want to know. Oh, Donan. The poor fool never could have guessed that Lilith would come for Astaroth, let alone offer his boy to it. But what does she buy in return? Astaroth hails from the realm of hatred, same as she. Perhaps she left something at home. Inarius' stupidity never ceases to amaze. Had he not murdered Rathma, Lilith might have been stopped, but now... Now she has the key to hell. We can assume she'll be looking for a door. Strange. I wrote to the Orbe Monastery the day I arrived. The abbot should have replied by now. Tekrin spoke of a rumor. A pale man seen near the canyons. The canyons? Why didn't you say so? We go at once. Ugh. But we can't leave Orbe unchecked. Sod it. I'm off to the canyons. You can meet me there or go to the monastery. You seem reliable thus far. Do not prove me wrong. The scholars of Orbe devote their lives to the study of forbidden knowledge. To serve the light, we must know the darkness, or some other silly platitude. I wrote to the abbot seeking insights on Lilith. His silence is most unusual. The man never misses a chance to speak. <laughs> is he insane, you mean? Elias was an exceptional mage. He would plunge through fire and shite in search of the truth, and very often found it. Whatever truth he has found in Lilith, only he can say the why of it. Time for our roads to part. I had hoped to find a witness who saw Elias. Instead, I have a camp of dead merchants. They were slaughtered by demons, that much is plain. But none were summoned here. We should search the canyons. Could Elias have summoned these demons? Easily. And assuming he did, he may still be here. Stay close to me. I hear a stone carver lives in that house. A man called Genbar. It's hidden. Isolated. Perfect for working in solitude. Reminds me of your house. <laughs> They're coming to a hell rift. I will close it. Far too easy. These demons were vermin. I'd expect more from a mage of Elias' ability. Let's search the house. 
Tread carefully. Elias could still be close. See what you can find. Today, Master Elias called at my door. I had trouble with my words, so I showed him my carvings. He said he could see my pain in them. The pain of a lonely man who had learned to hate the world. And yet, our mother, Lilith, found me beautiful. He said there are others like me as well. And together, we will build the new world. What a damn mess. Burning hells! We're too late. Elias is long gone. This Genbar is our summoner. How can you be certain? Isn't it obvious? Elias finds Genbar alone, friendless, full of anger. So he plays him like a fiddle, offers him Lilith's love and a part in his grand delusion. Then he gives him tools to express his anger. Summoning scrolls. Very perceptive. Who knows how long Gamba has stewed in this madness. Let's hope he can still be questioned. Elias, to show me the way. I long for the day when we stand by your side and set the cleansing fire. Visitors, D did Master Elias send you? Master Elias? Well, yes, in fact, he did. Ours is a very important mission. We have something for the Master, but we had heard he was with you. Do you know where he is? Liar! Dirty pig's born liar! The Master has all he needs! Rise now! My wrist is to me! Well done. Bad news first. Gemba was expecting someone. It seems Elias has turned others to his madness. Taught them to summon too, I'd wager. You heard Gemba. The Master has all he needs. They're about to do something drastic. And the good news. <laughs> Elias gave us a gift, remember? 
This demon he sent to kill us, it is unique. It requires constant feeding, human sacrifices in fact. If I cut open its belly, someone inside might hold a clue, tell us where it came from. I must have it brought to Kedbardu for examination. Make yourself useful and head for the Orbe Monastery. See what's keeping that bloody abbot. The dry steps have no Cathedral of Light, no Druids, and their capital city, Gulran, has been sacked. Many are vulnerable, just like Genbar. We must learn what Elias has planned for them. Elias had a talent for persuasion. Convenient trait for a Haradrim, given our dealings. But he could be... relentless when he wanted something. Even cruel. In that way, he and Lilith are similar. Suffering. Bloodshed. To them, these are a means to an end. They will bring out the worst in each other. Thank you. This place has been taken. It reeks of forbidden spells. Is anyone here? And evening. And to evening. I shall keep it safe. And then... <laughs> the abbot. Open the door. And the pale devil smiled. He took the forbidden knowledge. Shh. It's all right. I've cleared the way out. Can you walk? There is no way out. What knowledge remains must never leave. And to evening I shall keep it safe. And into the night hereafter. We must protect the archive. From morning, my eyes were opened. And I saw the coming darkness. Through the day, I have prepared to accept the burden of knowledge. Unto evening, I shall keep it safe, and into the night hereafter. No, I deserve to burn with the rest of it. Where is Elias? Gone. He said the ruin of sanctuary was imminent and only I could help. He is going to summon a lesser evil. He took all he needed and then my scholars, he murdered them. He Human knowledge shall be shared among the children of Lilith, and no secret shall be kept from them. And the liars and learned thieves of the world shall perish in their regret. What did he take? Scrolls from the Forbidden Archive. He has the means to summon a lesser evil. In what? Which bloody one? Where? Oh, we don't know, of course. Elias could cover the steps in blood, but a lesser could wipe out the continent, or worse. Come, Elias' pet demon is inside. Pray it leads us to him. He asked me endless prying questions. Frankly, I should be more concerned about your past. Trusting one soul connected to Lilith is quite a risk on my part, and one I do not take lightly.
perhaps you are too young. The prime evils you should know, Diablo, Mephisto and Baal. The lessers are their rotten kin, Asmodan, Belial, Andariel and Duriel. Each of them has ravaged humankind since the dawn of history and they will gladly do so again. It was protecting that fool, Genma. <sighs> this is Elias's work. But where is he? The answer lies in the stomach. <laughs> This is delicate. A soft noble's hand. Elias would have to feed this thing with more than fancy boots. That's someone's son. Or daughter. We should burn demons. This is wrong. Ah. This medallion bears the crest of the ruler of the royal house of Gulran. Former ruler. Obviously. That's enough, old man. The dead deserve respect. The dead deserve nothing when the living are in danger. Now Gulran has a new ruler, and we have Elias to thank for it. The dead may be worthless to you, but that medallion could bring peace to those two mourning. Fine. If we are to find Elias, then we must also travel to Gulran. Meet me there, and be swift about it. Oh, and avoid the city gates. Too many cannibals. Go to the cliffs. Good of you to come. Pity you didn't bring an army or siege works. Elias is here? Gone to the palace, no doubt. Behind the high wall with the gates barred behind him. We can't get through. You know who can. Zelaya. Chia. How many messages did I send? Huh? How long has Ohyun been missing? Trapped in there with those butchers? She may be the only one left who knows of the tunnel. If she's still alive, if this tunnel exists at all. You don't trust me. Of course not. You're a thief. Useful years ago, true. But it's clear you have some other reason to seek this, or you. Not your business. If I were to look for Oyun, where would I start? She has a house in the market square. We were supposed to meet there before, but I couldn't get close. Try to come back alive. Not convinced this old union is worth the risk, but perhaps you'll prove me wrong. Yeah. Have a little faith for once, old man. Someone named Oyu. I, I, I don't know. The cannibals are rounding everyone up, killing, feasting. But a few, they drag away. The prisons, I heard. Why would these monsters keep anyone alive? The prisons. Maybe there is a chance Oyu lives. Yeah. You're not 
not him. Who are you? The chopping. It stopped and I thought... I thought he was coming for me next. Your friend Zolaya sent me. She... She's still here? You'll see her soon. We need to get through the market. I... I know another way. It's safer. The old prison wing. It was sealed off years ago after an earthquake. Where did the cannibals come from? Here. They were prisoners. A clan of bandits. Led by Tyrant Bro. I overheard them talking about a, a new age to come and the man who would bring it. Elias. I think he turned them into these monsters. Set them free. The wall ahead. That used to be the entrance to the old prison wing. I, I thought it would be safe to stay. We'll get through. Stay close. Oh, we made it. I can't stop my hands from shaking. Give me a moment. I... I saw him at the royal court. He walked in unannounced, demanded the city to be given to him. The overseer sent him to the prisons, of course. They laughed about the strange man all night. That was the last time they laughed. Royal blood ruled Guran for generations. Decadent and cruel, but they were saints compared to Bro. I was waiting for Zolaya at my home. When I realized she wasn't coming, I, I tried to run. But those monsters caught me. Yes, where is she? Keep that beast quiet. It's safe now. Nothing will get you up here. She's really here. Kept yourself in danger. Oh, you stubborn cow. Of course I waited. Where would I go without you to tell me? Anywhere. Away from here. Yes, well... You are a lucky fool. I'll give you that. Ah, Lorath here sent this one to find you. They need your help getting into the palace. There's an old escape tunnel. The entrance is in the caverns nearby. Behind an alcove marked with the Overseer's Cross. Twin sabers joined at the hilt. Press the left pommel to open the way. Caverns. Hmm. Could be worse. Wanderer. Thank you. Take care of yourself. I think that was the merchant's horse. Best not tell him. You know, when we first met, I assumed this connection you have with Lilith would lead you to darkness, as it has Elias. But after the good you've done here, Maybe I was wrong. We shall see. While you were in the city, I was thinking on Elias's plans. Which of the lesser evils he means to summon. What he did to go round is a clue. 
He has drowned it in blood. Meaning his goal is likely Duriel or Andariel. What's the difference? Duriel feeds off physical pain, Andariel revels in mental and emotional torment. Whichever one it is, if Elias succeeds, many more cities will share Gulran's fate. Our only hope is he hasn't completed the summoning yet. Oyun said the tunnel is in a hidden alcove. Twin sabers, just as Oyun described. Elias has finished his grand work. What work? You will see soon, bro. The seeds we have sown will bear fruit. Gulran will be reborn and so will... But work? Elias, he is poised to summon Andariel into the world. Her, her power will lift us to new heights. And of course, you, you will have more meat. Huh. I want to watch. Certainly, Great Brawl. You will be the guest of honor. Andariel, the Maiden of Anguish. That is the lesser evil he means to summon. Heavens help us. Look at all this. An archive of the Forbidden, handpicked by Elias himself. He must be planning to summon Andariel somewhere else. But he did his research here. Look around. There might be some clues that can tell us where the ritual will take place. Don't tell me you were meddling in the Heraldric Vault. I put a seal on his quarters for a reason. The fool thought he could use their power against the prime evils. Fight fire with fire. I gave him an ultimatum. Stop or leave the Haradrim. You know the rest. I recognize many of these books. I must have stolen them from the Haradrim vault. The prophecy is unfolding before my eyes. I was right to act on it. When the prime evils come, they will find no easy prey. We will be ready. Our rebirth begins here, with Andariel chained to the heart of Gulran. She will feed on the suffering in this city of anguish. And we, in turn, will feed on her. And Ariel's power will be ours to wield against the other Lords of Hell. If more must die to see it come to pass, so be it. I will not fail you, Mother. And Ariel. Chained to the heart of Gulran. Her evil will not stay contained here. It will drown the land in suffering. This is beyond madness. Quite the opposite. Elias' mind is clear for once. When I knew him, he was searching for purpose. I couldn't give him one, and so he found it in Lilith. I didn't stop him. I let him become... this. Now is our chance to make it right before things get even worse. Yes, we have what we need. The summoning will take place at the Temple of the Primes in Mount Sivo. Now to find a way out. Knowing Elias, he would have had an escape route in case things didn't go his way. Behind the bookcase, 
I guess that's the one thing he learned from me. Should have killed him when I had the chance. We must hurry. Somewhere in this paradise, the Triune has reclaimed its ancient temple. Trouble is, we can't simply walk in. Elias was researching something about shrines to Mephisto, Baal, and Diablo. Only the blessed can open the way. Yes, but to be blessed by the prime evils. Damn risky. If it is the key to getting inside the temple, I will take the risk. Bale Shrine is close. We'll start there. They worship the Lords of Hell. Or at least they used to. If the Triune is working with Elias here, it must mean they pledged themselves to Lilith. It all comes down to power. The old cult bowed to the primevals little more than slaves to demons. But through Elias, through Lilith, they can become masters of demons. Or so they think. The blessings are just a means to an end. Elias needs the temple, a place of demonic power where he can summon Andariel. Lord of Destruction. His influence has launched every war in history. Never once has he tired of conflict. Speak his true name. Tor Belos. Tor Belos. <coughs> Are you all right? I'm... I'm fine. Two more shrines to go. Diablo and then Mephisto. Stay strong. Diablo, Lord of Terror. Every mortal fear, every nightmare, he is the root of it all. Always has been. Speak his true name. Al Diabolos. Al Diabolos. <laughs> Mephisto, Lord of Hatred, Father of Lilith. You need to be careful. Her blood is already a part of you. I can handle it. You see? The power here is already agitating you. I told you I can handle it. Tell me what to say, and then go search for the temple. So be it. When you're ready, speak the name Dull Mephistos. But watch yourself. Do Mephistos. their place anymore, do they? <laughs> His meddling has drawn echoes of the past to my refuge of hatred. But you and I can put things back in order. Once you've brought peace to this realm, I will be able to give you my blessing.
Hello. Well done. You were born for this. I didn't expect a prime evil would need a mortal's help. Yes, I've had some bad luck in recent years. Trapped in those soulstone trinkets. Cast back to hell. My essence is reforming, and so my power has limits. We all have our ups and downs, don't we? You deserve far worse. All I have done is offer you help, and yet you repay me with hatred. Why not focus that anger on Lilith for the time being? Take my blessing. Destroy her. Save your world. Victims of my brother, Bale. He laid waste to the barbarian lands long before your time. I wish I could have seen it with my own eyes. I had no part in it, though. Elias has upset the balance at the Temple of the Primes. And those shades of the past belong in Bale's domain, not mine. But, I do welcome their hatred. Time for our roads to part. What took you so long? I saw something at the shrine. A wolf. Hmm. The Fisto has been known to take such a form. It's not the first time I've encountered him. What? When you kept this from me? We all keep secrets, don't we, Haradrim? We don't have time for this now. Elias could be in the middle of his ritual already. Clear your head before we press on. The Temple of the Primes is just ahead. myself. Stay to the shadows.
Please, come with me. You are courting pain and death. Precious manner. Farewell. Uh, what... what happened? It feels like fire crawling over my skin. Uh. You were tattooed. A ritual. I... Oh, hear something. A voice in my head. And Ariel. A connection was made between you and her. Who are you? Ta... Taisa. Who are you? I am Loras. One of the Haradrim. Haradrim? So... So is Elias. If he told you that, he was lying. I came to kill him. Thought I had, but the moment I looked away, he vanished. If he survived, he will have fled to his refuge. Refuge? He has a palace. Somewhere in the deserts of eastern Kedjistan. But that is all I know. Well, there's one bit of good news. With him gone, perhaps the cannibals in Gulran will fall into disarray. We should get to Tassarak. The people there know the deserts of Keshistan well. Maybe someone has heard of this palace. Let me join you. I don't know how much help I will be in this condition, but... I owe you my life. You don't owe us anything. But you are welcome to come. You deserve vengeance too. Just rumors, mostly. The people here speak of a sorcerer who lives in a grand palace beyond the endless sandstorm. One of these nomads could help us reach it. They know the land better than... Taisa. Andaria. I hear her. I need a place to focus. Keep her voice at bay. Look for a guide. I'll get something to help Taisa clear her mind. I was hunting him, much like you. Infiltrated the cult to get close. Somehow, he was ready for me. He is more powerful than he seems. They saved my cousin's life, and she's worthless. Mm. <laughs> Can't argue with that. You'll find none fool enough to accept that request here. Give up, and stay alive a day longer. Are you mad? There's a sorcerer living in that storm who will rip your flesh from your bones. Ha! No chance. Not for all the gold in Chaldean. Wait. 
What about the old man? Ha! I'd sooner walk backwards into the burning hells than rely on him. But he might be the only one crazy enough to agree. He spends his days in a fog by the banks of the Argentec River. It's no place for kind souls. Be careful. Found a quiet spot where she can focus on controlling Andario's presence. Is it safe to leave her here? Safer than stumbling blind through the desert. At least until we find a reliable guide. Hmm. Every day brings new fools. I'm not the one who's gonna roll their corpses into the river this time. <laughs> no chance. You'd better turn around and walk out of here, friends. <laughs> well, can't say I didn't warn you. Uh, what's that? I'm paid up, leave me be. We're not here to collect. We need... Huh? This can't be. Can it? Is that a symbol of the whole? The horror of... Uh, Horadrim? Yes, Horadrim. Dekat? Dekat Kane? Can it be you, old friend? It's me! My sheep! No. Dekat is gone. My name is Lorath. We need your help passing through the sandstorm to the north. Sandstorm, eh? The others must have turned you down. Told you some rubbish about a sorcerer, I'll wager. <laughs> yeah. Well, what can a sorcerer do to me that time hasn't already? <laughs> yes, yes. I'll help. There's an old chapel near there. An auspicious spot to begin a new adventure. Good. Gather whatever you need. I'll fetch Thaisa and meet you there. This is wonderful! Like old times, eh, Deckard? Ah, you're here! Deckard is inside with your friend. The moment we stepped inside, Andario grew desperate. But her screams are only a whisper now. This is holy ground. Her influence will be weaker here. Terrible things. Mad things. She knows of Lilith's return and what Elias is planning. But Andario does not care who wins, only that someone loses and that their suffering is extreme. No. I've been a burden for you already. One day, I will find a way to help you. I am. Up to Taisa, whether she'll join us, though. Every part of me wants to walk through that storm and draw Elias' blood. But... Perhaps he is counting on my vengeance to lead me back to him. So he can finish what he started. It is safer for everyone if I stay. No shame in that. It's the wise choice. We'll bring you his head. Hasn't told you much about himself, eh? I remember when you couldn't stop him from talking. We met several lifetimes ago. In Aranak, I believe. Or oh, maybe Lutgalain. That's right. Oh, I was a sailor back then. And a handsome one, too. Deckard was always such an intense fellow. But kind and dependable. 
took it upon himself to right any wrong he found. <laughs> and we found many. To think I would find them here of all places. Still just as intense and still traveling with interesting company. <laughs> <laughs> Are you? Oh, I hope you've lined your pockets with healing drafts. <laughs> if not, help yourself to the ones I keep on old Isabella here. <laughs> Storm's going to get worse, too. I can smell it. When it starts to kick up, we'll have to find something to shelter us, or there'll be nothing left of us but bones and stories. Just savoring the moment. This is going to be a trek to remember, eh, Descartes? I can't wait! Turning angry! Follow me! No, I, uh, I've had quite enough. It's all yours. Ah, I won't turn down such generosity. Seems it's dying down. <laughs> Onward! No, back. We need to go back. What? What's wrong? My pipe back at the chapel. We must go back and get it. Old oh, man, if you turn your back now, I'll be the first to bury a blade in it. Bah, fine. But I won't forget this betrayal, Deckard. And you know I won't. Ah, Deckard. Do you remember the smell of the salt air on the ocean? No shade or devil could stand in our way. Been all across this world since then. I've seen things you wouldn't believe. But it was never quite the same. Wandering without a direction, it was just waiting. Aye. It's important to have something to walk towards. One foot in front of the other, eh, hey, old friend? If we stop walking, we die. Sounds like the winds have calmed. Yeah, that wasn't half as dangerous as the others made it seem. Look at this. To think such an intriguing place was hidden beyond the storm. A relic from the old days of Kedjistan, maybe. Lost to time until Elias seized it. He must have stole some treasure, eh? Masif, don't move. Don't speak to anyone. There is great danger lurking here. You've grown fearful in your old age, my friend. But worry not. I will stay put. Elias chose them to join his anointed circle? Ha! <laughs> that one in rags will never survive what is to come. Heard that noble from Chaldeum was dragged away for questioning the mother. He had to face the wolves. Fool got what he deserved. 
It was Master Elias' hand that brought Lilith to Sanctuary, and it will be his hand that binds a lesser evil to our will. Imagine when we hold that kind of power. I haven't seen you before. We just made it through the storm. By the Mother's grace. Ah, new disciples. You've come at an auspicious time. Lilith recently graced us with her presence. She was here. Oh, it was magnificent. But do not worry. Perhaps Master Elias will give you a glimpse of her through the sightless eye. If he deems you worthy, go inside and present yourself to him. Thank you. Damn. This is worse than I thought. Elias has the sightless eye. It's ancient magic. He can see anywhere with it. Across time, even. Our flock has grown. Behold, the wonders that the Mother has in store for you. Raise your heads high, champions of Lilith! Never again will we fear demons! They will serve us in the war to come. Go forth and stand in judgment before Master Elias. But show no fear, no hesitation. Don't worry, we won't. the sightless eye while we still have time. We can't leave it with these fanatics. Hold on. I see something. Blood petals. Let the weak 
fend for themselves. Vision. Lilith thinks the prime evils will destroy Sanctuary, and she's empowering people to stand against them. That's why she and Elias are gathering followers. They're building a bloody army. Yes, Laura. The Lords of Hell threaten our existence, and we are doing something about it. Elias, how are you still alive? You will never understand what I have done for this world. I have time to do that. After all these years, this is the best you can do! Why the bastard guy? We can't keep bashing our heads against him like this. He'll wear us down. We need to escape, but not without the sightless eye. If we can take it, that'll rob him of some power at least. In the mountains, the mother and I saw a village. The people, cold and hungry, prayed to a light that would give them no warmth. But in her presence, a new fire was stoked in their hearts. They would never go hungry or feel cold again. Open your heart to her. Embrace your nature. Never. You will give up at some point, old man. It's what you always do. That stench. Unnatural. Some kind of necromancy. Where did he find this power? Are you looking for the eye, Lorath? Taking it will change nothing. It is too late to stop what Lilith has begun. <laughs> You can do better than this, can't you? Stop holding back, Laura! Here it is. The sightless eye. Mashif can help us get the artifact far from this place, but we need to hurry before Elias returns. That opening over there is our best chance of escape. Put pressure here. We need to stop the bleeding. 
It seems I've lost a step in my old age, eh, Terracotta? No. Hey, <coughs> you made it. Did you kill that sorcerer fellow? Don't talk. The storm was broken. We'll get you out of here. Oh, it's a shame. <coughs> I got mine. Just a hair too late. Sneaky devil poked me in the back. <coughs> Skewered like a quill rat. So it goes. Hey, dear God. So it goes. They'll be coming. I'm taking the sightless eye. We need a safe place to study it. Use it against them. We'll meet at the desert chapel. Go. In fact, trouble is, he won't stay dead. Hmm. He is more powerful than I thought. I underestimated him. So did I. But we took something important from him, at least. The sightless eye. I think he was using it to commune with Lilith from afar. A powerful piece of magic. And dangerous. Perhaps we can use it to our advantage. Give me some time to study it. The prime evils were reforming. Hell was coming. But Elias was not the answer to anyone's prayers. If you want to take the measure of someone, you judge them by their deeds, not their words. Simple as that. Elias preached of saving the world while standing atop a mountain of corpses. Then there was the Wanderer. Everything Elias was not. Tainted by Lilith's blood, and yet able to resist her corruption. That was what I witnessed in the Wanderer's deeds. And that was when I started to think that perhaps together, we could keep the evil at bay. Must have been gruesome in that cult of his. No more gruesome than the rest of Sanctuary's underbelly. He deserved better. Damn it. I brought him into this. Of course, their entire faith hinges on it. Inarius is the spear that will pierce hatred's heart. The knight's penitent to the weak made strong. Prava is the mother who will mold the new age from the ashes. They found a way to weave themselves into every part of it. It's a relic from when the world was young. For many years, an order of rogues called the Sisters of the Sightless Eye kept it safe. Not sure how they lost hold of it, but I've heard the Sisters are not as strong as they once were. Knowledge of their craft has spread to others, but most rogues you see these days are not true members of the order. I can shut out Andariel's whispers most of the time, but not always. Better a whisper than having her walk the world again. Andariel is part of Lilith and Elias's plan. But how? What do we know so far? Lilith made a deal with Astaroth. 
Hmm. A demon who served her father. Interesting choice of ally. And she has a key to hell. A place where she's seen as a traitor. So why would she go? And is she already there? We need answers. Elias used the sightless eye to contact Lilith. Perhaps it can help us. Bring it here, would you? It's risky, but we haven't got a choice. When you're ready, picture Lilith in your mind and gaze into the eye. is reforming. How do you know? I feel it. Like a thousand old wounds ripped open again. He is still weak. Vulnerable. I must strike before he can resist. Make his power yours. The other lords will we're looking for her. Only a matter of time before she comes after us. Not necessarily. What do you mean? Mephisto is reforming. And Lilith aims to take his power while he is still weak. So, that's what you've been preparing for. She takes Mephisto's power. She'll become like a prime evil herself. She'll be able to conquer hell and sanctuary alike. I have an idea how to stop her. But for it to work, we'll need the help of an old ally. Deliver this message to Dolan. He'll have gone to Kyobushad for guidance. More than I care to now. Her pain is primal. Wordless. Once. She was part of something more. Ugh. She doesn't like me to think on it. It would strike a blow against hell, that much is certain. But is it really for our benefit, as she claims? All her actions are driven by hatred. That is her nature, and she can never change it. I'm saying it's impossible to know. She can peer into hearts, tell us what we want to hear. You've seen it with Donan, Elias and others. To trust her would mean gambling with the fate of all humankind. Not a risk I'm willing to take. The beginnings of a plan to thwart Lilith. One thing's for sure, we need a soul stone. And that means we need Donan. He'll understand when you deliver the letter. Farewell. After... After everything... brushed aside...
good news for once, I hope. It's from Lorath. Oh, wonderful. Hmm. Hmm. Soulstone. What? Is he serious? What does it say? He didn't tell you? No, of course not. That would require some basic degree of consideration. It's written in our code. He sent a plan. Though calling it that is generous. He wants to imprison Lilith with my Soulstone. The one that held Astaroth. Can it work? Certainly not. The stone needs to be attuned first. And he will need an expert for that. Laura thinks that expert is you. Then he is even more foolish than I thought. <sighs> Go to the Horadric Vault, will you? I'll dig up what he needs. You can deliver it. And maybe then you'll leave me alone. Hold on. Did Lorath offer you his horse for the journey? No, wait. What am I thinking? Of course not. I'm old friends with the stable master in town. Tell him I sent you, and he'll offer you a steed. I appreciate that. For all the good it did, after Skos Glen, I hoped he could give me, I don't know, forgiveness, guidance, anything. He spoke of the prophecy, his campaign against Lilith. I offered my help, but all he said was, what use has a general for a broken soldier? It's not what was in it, but what wasn't. He didn't even have the decency to mention. Ah, uh, it doesn't matter now. He's come down from the mountain, yes. But he's still the same man who went up. Farewell. Conan. Ah, now there's a good man, a champion of the faith. Not like that old crank you were with earlier, what was his name? Uh, Lord Fam, Morath? <laughs> Doesn't matter. I know uh, Donan's been through some hard times of late, so I'm happy to help him however I can. Take one of my steeds, free of charge. even gone in yet. We have an intruder. It's not like that. She's but a child. You brought a child? Here? It was she who brought me, actually. Where you swing that staff? It's not a toy. Who is he? He once lived in this vault, the one you're trespassing in. Explain yourself. I'm a student conducting research on the Haradrim. What's left of you a all in anyway? A student, huh? You have a teacher? Don't tell me Lorath has taken another apprentice. <laughs> I don't need a teacher to study. Lilith... Lilith... threatens Sanctuary as we speak. I need to prepare for that. With <gasps> or without help. <laughs> you? Against Lilith? Well... I came to get my things. I pray they were free from your meddling.
Prime evils may be subdued, but they can never be ended. Even from their home in the Hells, they can still influence our world. Walk it unseen. When weakened, they've been known to take the form of strange animals. A one-eyed owl, a wingless bat, or a wounded wolf. I used to be like that girl. I had more dreams than I knew what to do with. Let me unseal this. Chakit. Chespit Hilm. The stone will need to be attuned to Lilith before Lorath marches up to her. It won't hold her well otherwise. I put together some notes on the process before I left. First things first, Lorath will need my notes. Soulstone magic is treacherous, even in the most skilled hands. Tread carefully. We summon the spirit in here. Radamak. Lorath assured me that he banished it for good, but I've always had my doubts. Always find a way in. Lilith hails from her father's domain. Hatred. That's the essence Lorath will need for the attunement. I kept a map. Somewhere. Uh, here. All the places Mephisto's hatred yet lingers. There's just one last thing. Yes. I bet Lorath still wears his. The Order's mission was his lifeblood. I couldn't give up my life for it. Not like him. I wanted to be a man. I left to chase family. Fellowship. Glory. And for what? You saw how that ended. My son... I can't do it. It wouldn't work anyway. Donan. You don't understand. The stuff soul stones are made of, they're old as the eternal conflict itself. With magic so primordial, you need faith. You need spirit. What you lack in faith, you have in allies. Who? You? Yes. You're the only one who can help us. <laughs> Unfortunately, you may be right. I can't make any promises. Really. But I can try. For you too? I'll try. Let's hear what the old man has to say. The old workshop. Laura Elias and I would spend days on end cooped up in here. Experimenting. Debating. Nothing to hold us back but our own imaginations. And how much of each other we could tolerate. This is a treasure trove. Look at this masterpiece. Call us beyond the veil of the southern jungles. You're familiar with Kalha's work? She's brilliant. One of my favorites. Mine as well. Have you read her treatises? Uh, never mind. You can tell me on the road. On the road? I'm going to help you. I know the Haradrim's ways, your magic, even that coded writing system you use. And, and don't tell me it's too dangerous. Lilith took my mother. 
I'll do whatever it takes to stop her. <laughs> That's a good speech. Might even convince the man you should be telling it to. Come on. I'm headed to him. But your Horodrim, isn't this your vault? It was once. Now, I suppose time will tell. I've only scratched the surface, but that will have to be enough. Lilith won't be stopped by studying alone. No, I don't think I will. If we fail, what would it matter whether all these secrets stay buried? Us three, Horadrim. Elias, Laura, myself, and an angel, Tyrael. An angel? Like Inarius? Very different from him, fortunately. Tyrael set off before Elias did. I don't know what drew him away, but I could tell he was afraid. We fell apart after he left. It is a curse, the bane of the Haradrim, but also our greatest weapon. There's nothing like it in existence. The first Haradrim used a set of soul stones to contain Diablo, Mephisto, and Baal. But such power comes at a cost. A soul stone must always be guarded. It consumes your days, your dreams. You become a prisoner just as much as the demon contained in the stone. And despite your efforts, the evil eventually finds a way to break free. Even so, I know of no better way to contain a demon. I wish I did though. Farewell. You were right to call upon me, you know. Soul stones are no trifle. There's the donut I remember. <sighs> I need air. I'm still muddy on the details of this plan. The bones are there. Lilith aims to take Mephisto's power for herself. Before she can reach him, we use the soul stone on her. Preparing the stone will take time we don't have. Why don't we fight her? Who among us? You. Her corrupted blood still runs in your veins. No. Fighting her kind is always a last resort. Even if you could defeat her, she'd eventually come back. But a smarter weapon, the stone, would be up to the challenge. So stones usually fail, given enough time. It might not work. You can make it work. There's no one I trust more to do it. The wind is picking up. I can't... I can't see her. Taisa! I'll find her. You're fumbling in the eye. Let me write to your little cat. If you hurt her... <laughs> hurt her? I elevated her! 
The runes inked into her skin form a waypoint. She is a beacon across realms. Get her out of here. It matters not. Her part is done. Your part is done too. Savor your breath. One. Time for our roads to part. the ritual from the volcano then Elias that's the man who summoned Lilith you're saying he summoned a lesser evil too keep up girl is Andariel gone yes and Elias he fled before going to the steps Elias came to Hawazar 
took something that wasn't his. It's why I'm hunting him. I have a friend in Hauza who has mastered the art of immortality. She might know his secret. Let me take you to her. I thought we were after Lilith, not Elias. Finding him may lead to her. And while we look for him, you'll have time to work on the stone. That's what you wanted, isn't it? Ah, damn it, I'll bite. On one of those rare occasions you gave me good advice. You said the answers you need are often in the place you least want to look. It was you who said that. Ah, you're right. <laughs> Let's get the horses ready. Not at first, but then he almost killed me, marked my skin, put a demon in my head. I will take pleasure from his death. The hunt will soon be over. You've angered him. He will come to you, and I will be there when that happens. If fate allows, let it be my hand that ends him. I thought I did. He was Lara's student in the Order. It used to be just the three of us. He was young then. I guess we all were. His thinking was always radical. But I never thought... I never thought it would come to this. I didn't mention it earlier, but uh, you did well. You stood against Andario, a lesser evil, and lived. That's no ordinary feat. But don't let it go to your head. The arrogance and foolhardy never last long in Hauzar. I wonder what old Deckard Cain would have written in his chronicles if he had seen us. Two old friends reunited. New allies eager to learn from our vast knowledge. Bound as one against the encroaching darkness, like the Haradrim of old. <laughs> they were probably lost and bitter, just like us. But Cain had a gift for seeing the good in people. One thing was certain, at least. Lilith meant to devour Mephisto and claim his power as her own. Had that been her goal all along? Not sanctuary, but a bid to reign in Hell. And Elias, the damned fool, was too blind to see it. Perhaps we weren't perfect. But we knew we had to make a stand. We were the world's only hope. Encased in salt.
Time for our roads to part. This place reeks of rotten flesh. What is this? An interloper. I am so close. Oh. Be gone! No! No! You won't stop my research! Subject 23. The plague of Alcanus was born from the dead of this city. Like all of the corpses here, 23's tissue appears flush with the demonic ether. <laughs> Still alive, in a sense, after decades of decay. If this vitality can be distilled, oh, I may have found more than a cure. What's going on? Leave! <laughs> were born from those growths. I must scour them all. The research is almost done! I need more time! I could end suffering! Your death! You are courting pain and death. Farewell. No. No, no more, please, no. The smell, the taste, I... I won't eat it, no. Oh, Yun, it's a Miz, Zolaya. I'm here. We are not in Guran. You're safe. You're from Guran. No. Get away from me. Are you all right? She was a fine when we left, but today she just snapped. I have an idea to calm her, but I can't leave her alone like this. Maybe you could help. I, I kept a stash of uncommon medicinal herbs in the hideout, in the caves northwest of here. The tea I made with them was Oyun's favorite. Perhaps the smell would help ground her. And it should help her settle her stomach. Take this. Fill it with the herbs if they're still there. Please hurry. Stay here. I'll return soon. You've returned. Oh, finally. Uh, give me the herbs. No. <gasps> I know, my dear. Now, just give me a minute to brew this tea. There. Oh, Yun, how do you feel? What? Where? Oh. Better, I think. Yes. Samaya, oh, I'm so sorry. I don't know what came over me. There was a spell, and, and then... Please. There's no need to apologize. I never expected you to be fine after everything you went through. Now, drink your tea. Rest. She seems to be calming down. For now. Once she's stabilized, I can go and collect more of those herbs. Thank you. Wait. I have a favor to ask. My journal's over there. Will you take them with you? Please, take them far away from here. This 
thing looks like it's been through hell. Let's see what we've got. A damned invoice, of course. This could have stayed lost, you know. Uh, actually, I better get this paid. It's dangerous to be in debt around here. Thanks for your help. <laughs> the bandit gangs are the law. I tell you to watch yourself, but you seem like you can hold your own. They're all stragglers from Chaldeum. Plague there wiped out half the city before they shut the gates. Seems like here's as good a place as any to die. Oh, it doesn't support itself. It supports the black market and the cult bastards that run it. Ain't you seen the slums? I appreciate that. You were a student of Elias's, Taisa? I was hunting Elias. Pretending to study with him was useful to me. Friends, did he tell you that? If he thinks so, you should ask him what happened. I don't care anymore. I'm starting to think taking you on this journey was a mistake. We must break his hold on immortality. He cannot continue to escape his judgment. Yes. And without Elias, we may have more success against Lilith. Where do we start? Seek out Timoe in the marshes. She traded with the power in the swamp and received long life. She may have the answer to killing Elias for good. Nairal and I will start looking for her. What about Donan? He has his hands full with the Soul Stone. A heavy burden to bear alone. Might be wise to offer him assistance. An old acquaintance who has lived in this place for countless years. She taught me much about the swamp and its power, though that was a long time ago. She might try to turn you away. Do not let her. It is a town at the edge of Hawazar. Forever between Sanctuary's power and the swamps. Ah, is it? Blessings of Ekarat be with you, child. Faith is infectious. The stronger the light in you, the brighter it shines on those around you. Bring your friends into our fold. Through fellowship and unity, our faith shall endure. I think not. I have to take care of the Soul Stone. Lorath will be fine alone. Northeast of here is a Zakarun Keep. We know hatred has a strong presence there. Perhaps we can use it to prepare the Soul Stone to trap Lilith. I could use your assistance, if you're able. Oh, what a lonesome place to come seeking knowledge. I thought we had no choice. Neither do we.
Another set of eyes, at last. I've been searching for Timoway with little success. Do you think Elias knew Taisa before she went to his house? I don't know, no. no. What do you know? Many things are shattered. Hmm. Only two kinds of people come looking for old Timoy. Those running away from trouble, and those running toward it. Which kind are you, I wonder? Never heard of him. We think Elias made a pact with the swamp to become immortal. Thaisa said you could help it. Thaisa. Only she would be cold-hearted enough to send a child to die out here. We've no intention of dying. One of you will. That's the way it always ends. Go back where you came from. I won't have a child's blood on my hands. I saw my mother possessed by Lilith. Driven so mad, it killed her. I'm not a child anymore. So be it. If this Elias made a pact, it was with the Tree of Whispers. There are many paths to reach it. But the nearest is in Ingovani. A sacred incense is kept in the temple there. Retrieve it, and your path to the tree begins. Go to Ingovani. Nayrell and I will see if we can get some more information out of Timoy. Yes. I was infected with the swamp's poison. And I made a pact with the tree out of fear. So now I give it knowledge. And in exchange it keeps me one step away from the grave. I wish it would just let me go. But a pact made cannot be broken. She was like you once. Standing here in my hut. Asking to be set on the path. And you will be like her. Taking the answers you need and never looking back. The swamp nests in the roots of the Tree of Whispers. This is how each path begins. The temple at Ingovani rests on one root, but it is no less or more important than any other root. The villagers, those fools. They wouldn't listen when we demanded the gems to open the temple. Death found them. It's the way of things, but I hear them still, their warnings. Four of us are dead now, and I am soon to follow. Farewell. the laws of the swamp. All things in the swamp must be earned. Nothing is free. Nothing is given or gifted. And to our god we pay the ultimate tithe. This must be it.
The ritual to summon Lilith would have been demanding. Perhaps he was afraid he wouldn't survive it. And I'm sure he expected to make enemies along the way. Good, you found the incense. I'll keep it safe for us. While you were gone, Timue warmed up to us. <laughs> well, to Lorath. He's surprisingly nimble with old women. Nerel. <laughs> she says there's an altar. That's what the incense is for. It's not far from here. But why did Tyrael believe the Haradrim would be a solution? We weren't a solution. We are... The world needs protectors. The incense should provide us with the path to the tree. What sort of path, I can't say. I can say that the time for questions, Nerel, has passed. Damn. They must have tracked our scent. When you're ready, light the incense. What now? We wait for the path to appear. I think it worked. How long were we out? I don't know, but I see something. See the serpent now. What do the scales show you? A deer caught in a trap. Uh, watch out! We need to find a way forward. Oh, there's an opening beneath the serpent, just big enough for me. 
I think it wants me to go through. Don't be ridiculous. We must follow the path. Is this green snake helping us off? Or did it corral us here? is watching us, whispering to us. It's the incense, playing with our heads, just, just an illusion. He hears us, just as you do, wanderer. The old man is full of secrets like our thief, the liar. Birds of a feather. Perhaps that is what we need. I lost sight of the serpent, but I hear it calling to me. Up ahead. Oh, there it is. There's no way through this time. Oh, it's wounded, though. Or is it telling us to wound it? Clever thinking. So, who will stab at it to see if it will move? Path again. Keep a sharp eye out. Is the serpent doing this? Forget the snake. Just kill these things before they kill us. So many come seeking answers. So many fail. Will you die like these souls? With a question still on your lips. Shut up, shut up. You aren't real. An old drunk. The judge of what is real. <laughs> we are real. And so is the Lord of the Swamp. To get the answers you seek, you must offer payment ahead for knowledge. Not yet. They have another purpose first. Look, it's moving. I know you heard the voices that time. Who were they? I don't know. We can't trust anything here, but we need to press on. That... is that... 
tree of whispers. Why have you come? Why have you come? We're after a man named Elias. Elias. Slippery, that one. He owes the tree. It deals in thoughts and insight in exchange for a head. He is the first of us to escape payment. Will you tell us what you told him? If we can stop him for good, the tree can finally collect. Hmm. He sought the way to summon Lilith, but he made another stop on the way. To a place beyond the tree's sight. That might explain his hardiness. I've damn near lost count of how many times we've killed him. So that's why Taisa failed so dismally to reclaim his head. This place Elias stopped at. How can we get there? Seek a coffin beyond the Rex. It will take you where you must go. Find out what secrets linger there. For the tree knows not. If there are wrecks to search, they'll be on the eastern coast. We'll head there now. Meet us when you can. prophecy spoke of a serpent, right? If Elias knew that too, maybe he came looking for it. Did he ever tell you what he was planning? No. By that point, he wasn't my student anymore. What happened? The moment Elias heard Rathma's prophecy, it poisoned him. He became obsessed with it. Prophecies are riddles. Not even the very wise can be sure of their meaning. But Elias believed he could solve it. And when I told him to wait, he called me a fool. Said we had to do whatever. You tried to stop him? Tried, yes. And failed. It'll be different this time. Let's find that damn coffin. Can you see the coffin from here? Any sign of it? Hmm. There's something at the far end of those ships. I see it too. We'll have to cross the wreckage to reach it. unlock the door from the other side. All right, go. Damn drowned! My arm! 
You've been infected. It's spreading. We have no time. I must remove the drowned necrosis. I don't understand. Laura, are you certain? I'm certain she's dying. Hold her. We have no choice. Now hold her. to the coffin. I'll look after her. Sorry. I apologize. Close. You're getting close. The edge of our sight. The limit of our knowledge. You see the way, don't you? Inside is the thing Elias hides. The source of his immortality. presence still taints this place. Every tome, every scroll, every book in this temple produces the same answer. The only being willing to stand against the eternal conflict, against the prime evils, was Lilith. The day I'm done with this self-righteous bastard will be a great one. Well done. Staircase is flooded. I need a way to cross it. Lilith, the mother of Sanctuary. She made us to be strong and was sealed away to weaken us. The daughter of hatred. I cannot say that there is good in her. 
Morality is the privilege of people in better situations. We are beyond the question of good or evil. But the question remains. What will she do to us if I summon her? When I summon her? I must prepare myself for anything. Rathma kept the means of attaining immortality here. Once I have mastered it, I will go and bring the mother home. Elias's immortality must be deeper within. Ugh. This. This is Elias's finger. He hid a piece of himself here to stay immortal. Greetings. Still resting, but her fever is broken. I think she'll be all right. The road that comes after, though, we shall have to see. I found you drifting in a coffin, clutching a severed finger. What happened? I'm not sure. The temple began to sink. And I thought I'd drowned. Temple. So the coffin was a gateway. What of Elias' immortality? He stored his life essence in a piece of himself. Burn it. Good. Let us end this then, once and for all. Let me end what I began. No one else is going to get hurt because of my choices. Find a place where I can be taken care of. Do you want to be left behind? No! I just... don't want to be a burden. Then we won't leave you. It never crossed my mind. No more time to rest. You should check on Donan. We'll meet you at the Zakarun Keep later.
Time for our roads to part. Oh, first Carlo, now Leah. There's something out there killing us and no one will do anything. There is a powerful evil out there killing folks. Surely you've seen the demons or those horrible charred remains. Oh, please, would you look for survivors near the old ruins to the northeast? We're desperate. Don't worry. I'll look into it. Please! Leave me alone! Cursed creature! Heretic! You will pay! Stop! Please! Cursed! <laughs> done. Farewell. No, but it's the only way I can go home again. Oh, oh God. It hurts. <laughs> Of course it hurts. You drank boiled poison. Who, who are you? Leave me alone! Your blood is inflamed. Close your eyes and breathe slowly. How? <sighs> Questions later. First drink this before you drop dead from your short-sighted brew. My name is Gullius. This child is not cursed. She has a great power within her. She's been chosen by the swamp, as I was years ago. What? Me? Yes, Anita. You are destined to become a witch of Hawazar. But I can't. I can't leave my mother. She's sick. She needs... You cannot help her in this state, but I promise to teach you what you need to care for her, to control your power. I... I... Anita, you cannot run from your destiny. What comes next will be very difficult. The least of it will be the journey to the eastern coast. What? I... 
time. Uh. Yes. Yes, thank you. I'll be all right. Goliath's ritual is just draining. Only when meddled with by well-meaning but ignorant visitors. Have the voices quieted, Anita? Can you understand them yet? Uh, it still hurts when they speak. They all talk over each other. I'm sorry. We don't apologize for things outside our control. Hmm. Something still inflames your blood. There is only one thing left to try. Uncontrolled magic weakens the fabric between this world and the Burning Hells. Anita wasn't trying to summon demons. They were drawn here unintentionally. I am a witch. A servant of the Tree of Whispers, and by extension, all of Hawazar. I was called as a child, the same as Anita. Some are called, and some are given. Regardless, it is our destiny to protect this place. Did you? I am impressed. I myself have not been in the tree's presence in some time. It must see a great potential, or more likely, a great value in you. It is ancient magic that should calm her blood. It will be painful, Nita. I hope you are prepared to pay the price. I'll do whatever it takes. Good. Go and gather four bloated livers from the rotting creatures out in the wilds. Worry not. I will take care of it. Anita is perfectly capable of handling this task. I wouldn't mind some company to keep an eye out while I work. Fine. Once you're done, meet me in the hidden glade east of here. Don't judge Goliath too harshly. She's been good to me. Teaching me ways to heal I never would have found in a book. That's not that easy exactly. But she expects me to accomplish things. And it makes me feel like maybe I can. Thank you for bringing my necklace back to me. It was a gift from my mother. She still loves me. Deep down. Anita, place the livers in the bowl. When you are ready, we will begin. Good. The rite is simple. I will draw beasts here, and you will slay them near the altar until the bowl is filled. Anita, protect yourself the way I instructed you. Oh, I... Yes, Goliath. Enough. That will do. Anita, drink as much as you can from the bowl. You see? They engage in dark heresy. What are you? What... What have you become? No! You're wrong! Goliath has... How dare you... <coughs> raise your voice to me! Her soul belongs to the demons now. Kill them all! You are courting pain and death. And this is your fault! You birthed that cursed creature! These deaths are on your head! <coughs> no! Die, witch! Stop! No! <coughs> Mother! Stop! Mother! Listen! Stop! <coughs> 
Yes. Impressive. Farewell. It's not fair! I just wanted to help her. Anita, your mother was beyond anyone's help. Nothing I did ever changed how she saw me. I was just a cursed child to her. All the way to the end. My dear, you cannot save anyone who refuses change. Your mother decided who she was long before you were born. The voices... They're finally quiet. It's time for me to go. Well done. Anita's already gone. You won't see her again. But she left you a letter. There, on the table. I'm sorry I wasn't able to say goodbye. The chorus of voices called to me. And I had to answer. I asked Goliath to return my mother's body to Zarbinset. She only protested a little. I don't know how to thank you enough. You protected me, a girl you barely knew, from danger so many times. I promise not to waste this chance you've given me. I know it's not much, but I want you to take this as a keepsake. Truly, thank you. The cultists who infest this area believe that through rituals and sacrifice, they can be reborn as one of the Nangari. The notion is ridiculous, of course. The Nangari care nothing for worship. But perhaps an alchemical process. There is a powerful Nangari necromancer who lives in the Fens. Bring me the necrotic flesh of one of her minions and samples of snake poison. Good. Hmm, yes. Give me but a moment. Then I will need you again. The potion is ready. To be thorough, we should test it on both cultists and non-cultists. There are many bandits in this area. Find some, add it to their food, and observe the results. Repeat the experiment with the cultists south of here. Return to me with the results. Hmm. Not unexpected, but it is disappointing. Perhaps those fanatics will yet find a way. But for now, at least, there are fewer of them causing problems. after the child, will you? Do not let her make a bargain. The swamp is always watching. It knows why you've come. It knows each and every bone that has sunk to the bottom of the black mud since time began. It sees all and more. And its wisdom grows with every fool who makes a pact with the tree. Oh, you shouldn't be touching things like this. Do you even know what this is? Unbelievable. Do you have no sense? Well, perhaps he didn't recognize it. 
Most don't bother to consider how someone like me becomes... like this. Not until it's too late. It's easier to think it a punishment for some imagined problem or some other such nonsense. Those who believe that do so for their own comfort. To distance themselves. To say that this could never happen to them. But we are all just one little thing. One moment. One little red sprig away from home. Remember that. Then you will always have compassion. Fine. Just wore myself out. Packing to visit my neighbors. They've got it worse than me. Poor souls. Infected, forsaken. Left to wander the swamp until it takes them. Since you're here, help an old woman. Take these supplies to Baridan, Duraya, and Raldine. Treat them kindly, or the swamp would hear of it. begins with the scratch of a tiny thorn. The flesh is open and the swamp flows in. Slowly, painfully, it grows inside until the swamp is all that you are. I'm... yes. Yes. I'm still buried then. Thank you. And think them away for me. Without these herbs, the days pass like years. I'm so sorry. Don't be. This place can be rather peaceful once you get to know it. But enough of that. Duraya could use some comfort. Try the northwest. Can't say where Alden's got to. for the pain, she says. I'll find my own herbs, thank you. Cure myself and leave this swamp for good. You can take that shite to Raldine, if he's still alive. Last I saw, he was headed east, towards the snakes. Best of luck. No. I... I was looking for my brother. He's sick, too. I've not seen him in days. I was afraid he'd grown roots. They... they attacked me. Tried to take me somewhere. One of them mentioned the camp by the coast. If they took my brother... Don't worry. I'll look into it. <laughs> and folk think we are monsters. There are men in this world who would take a dying boy, hack the source from his body, and sell them like herbs to the alchemists. But you've sated the swamp with their blood. We'll go now. I live with our gratitude. Such heat. Yet the town. Honorable 
Crusaders of Zakarun. Our neighbor, Eriman, is the witch you seek. With this act of good faith, we beg for your mercy. Let this be an end to the burnings. Heretics. They are destroying the people we have loved and protected you for generations. It is we, the witches of the swamp, who hold the darkness at bay. Burning us will bring no light to Hawazar. You are courting pain and death. Farewell. It's gone. So many years I held it at bay. Then the Crusaders came. You were all so scared. I cannot hate you for giving me to the pyre. I forgive you. I appreciate that. Do you feel that? Mephisto's touch is heavy here. All that hatred. It's just what we need to attune the Soul Stone, to make it ready for Lilith. I'm too old to climb, but you can get in and open the portcullis. The fitful resting place of a Zakarum leader pursued by Nephisto. A group of holy paladins built the keep and entombed the body within. Looks abandoned now, though. Did she? She could be right. Even the air feels laden with an otherworldly sort of magic. What? I should have brought her with me instead. The sooner we're back together again, the better. I can see how he would come to that conclusion. She is the mother of Sanctuary, and she has sided with humanity in the past. But his logic is flawed. To Lilith, humanity and this world are her possessions, her dominion. And they always will be. Everything here makes my skin crawl. Do you hear that? How strange. 
are there wolves in Hawazar? Feels worse here somehow. This must be the place. I haven't fought much since I was a young man. I've lost the grip for it. Whatever else is here, hatred persists. Strong enough to attune the soul stone. Reyatyon, Dan Tnis, Beri, Dis, Tom Iklimon. Damn it! What's wrong with it? Come on. Come on. You old fool. What's wrong with it? Why will... This is worse than I thought. It must have been damaged when you're in... Astaroth. Do you know how to repair it? We'll need... rare materials. Quicksilver to start. And tools. Alchemical tools. There's a village near here. We'll see if they have what we need. Meet me there when you can. It's probably foolish, but, but part of me hopes some traces of my family remain among the ashes. I'll say it once more. Whatever it is you're looking for, we don't have. The town doesn't seem to have anything that we need. We're a village in the middle of a swamp. There must be something. I can feel the magic in this swamp, and where there is magic, there are users of magic. If a witch is what you want, go to the tower then. Fire's lit, she's home. Sounds as though we go to meet a witch of the swamp. Be on guard. There's witches all over Hawazar. But we leave them alone, and they let us alone. I can't. See what's around you? That's all there is. We're deep enough to have escaped the arms of Zakarum. Small blessing though that may be. <laughs> Look around. Nothing from outside the swamp comes in this far and remains. There is one power here. And no light, angelic or otherwise, can reach it. Aid would be welcome. Thaisa? <laughs> You're the witch in the tower? Horadrim, I thought you journeyed to the keep. Yes, well... And why would I help you? Well, we all want Elias dead. We do. But fixing the soul stone, that is about Lilith, and she does not concern me. I don't need much, just Quicksilver and the tools you have there. <laughs> Such small asks rarely remain so. Surely you must know this. But you did help me survive Andaril's summoning. So. My tools are yours. 
You will have to go to Valtha for Quicksilver, though. Find her, and she will give you what you need. The Haradrim have studied the Soul Stone for generations. I have studied it for more than 20 years. But there aren't enough books in Sanctuary to contain what we don't know about it. It will take a miracle. But that's what you expect from me, isn't it? Well... Yes, Haradrim. What do you think of me? I've been... My life has kept me in Skos Glen for many years now. I haven't met anyone like her, you, since before my son was born. Strange as it may sound, you remind me of what it was like to be young. To adventure. To encounter danger? To believe I can defeat it. Yes. Yes, I am too. If I had written to Lorith and stayed in Eldheim. If I raised Yorin to be a scholar rather than a soldier. It doesn't matter. Sister in trade and service. But don't think that we are your witches from folk tales. Valtha is no potion dealer. Tread lightly with her. Because I have chosen to. You will make Elias mortal. I will be there to collect his debt. Did you come here to pry into my personal affairs, or to mend your soul stone? She showed me kindness when I was young. Not long ago, I finally found a way to repay that debt. A salve to cure her affliction. But she refused it. Called me a fool for even trying to change her fate. That was the last time I saw her. It is quite clear she does not want my help. Not the salve, no. But maybe it's enough just to be at her side. It is not enough for me. Then is all this really about her or you? You have a habit of snooping around other people's homes. Yes. Thaisa has unknowingly sent you to your death. In the end, she will see the foolishness of her pursuit of Elias. And she will know that Lilith is our future. You are caught in pain and death. More ashes for the cauldron! Greetings. Time for our roads to part. Ah, you're back. Place the purified Quicksilver in that bowl on the table. Even more restless than before. He's lost a son. And inside his grief chips at him every moment he refuses to face it.
And how was my sister? Valtha chose Lilith over your friendship. Elias convinced her to join him. That can't be. She would have known not to trust Elias. It wasn't Elias that seduced her, but Lilith. She found her ideals convincing. Valtha was my teacher. She guided me when I first began my service. This is... <sighs> Difficult to believe, I know. I've seen my allies throw their lot in with Lilith. People I thought were stronger than that. But that is why we must press on and mend the stone so no one else will fall to her lies. First off, the... that the Quicksilver mix some of it into the pot. Raise the flame. Turn the wheel... Um, twice. Or is it three times? Give it another turn. What am I forgetting? The sulfur. Grind it in the mortar. not up to the task. What can we do? I suspect he no longer trusts himself. We cannot erase all his doubt, but his most recent grief, his son, there is a way. He won't enjoy it though. Why help him? You could simply leave us to our fates. Everyone needs a reminder every now and then that you can defeat danger. You only have to try. Haradrim, come here. What? Why? I want to take you somewhere. A place of old power in this swamp. I think it will do you some good. There's nothing left for me to do. Can't you see that? Let me return. Return? Return where? <sighs> ah, no, Haradrim. You will remain with us. There is still more to do. Swamp's magic is more potent here. Valtha brought me to this place when I was younger. Here, you can face your demons, whether they be fear or grief. Who is... No. No, I've had enough of this. And what will you do instead? Hmm? Nothing in this swamp is free, Haradrim. Not even your magic. Whatever logic you think will win the day, 
You are mistaken. I... Where is your sense of adventure? Huh? Not buried in your youth, is it? <laughs> Go outside and make an offering to the swamp. A ring. A necklace. Something you hold dear. While you do, our friend here will collect two things. Maggot Icor and Yellow Lotus. This is foolish. Thalthar forged me into the witch I am. I struggle with her death. I understand where she saw a future in Lilith. The mother of Sanctuary isn't so different from the witches of Hawazar. But I won't ever shirk my duty in bringing Elias to justice. That is the part of Vatha I will never understand. Not today, but a time will come when I must shed the unrest that plagues me. Good. Make haste. The Haradrim tires of waiting. Set the swamp's gift in the pot to brew a tea. I simply think this is a waste of your time and mine. Do you see the braziers? Light each of them. Then we will drink the tea and wait. For what? For the swamp to call out to your soul and draw what festers from you, like poison from a wound. Didn't 
I warn you, the Haradrim would only hold you back. so consumed by their emotions that they forget what really matters. Lilith is the true threat, not Elias. I know why you're so afraid of her. My fate is tied to yours. If she devours me, sanctuary is lost. But you still have a chance to stop her. What if I opened a portal for you out of this swamp? Let the Horadrim deal with Elias. He is their sin to bear. You and I can work together to stop Lilith. I know who my real allies are. My friends. Take me back to them. The day of reckoning will come. And your true friends will be revealed. Now, take the portal back to your allies. your hope in Inarius, if that's who you mean. The angel was my prisoner. I have seen his true face. He and Lilith are not as different as you might think. Refine his anger. When he escaped back to your world, he brought it with him. If Lilith prevails, you'll only have yourself to blame. No. Time for our roads to part. I don't know yet. He wandered around for hours until the tea wore off. A long journey through the swamp is more rewarding than a short one. Yours was even longer, it seems. Did you face your inner demons as the Haradrim did? Yes. Hopefully for the last time. Let us begin. Mix the quicksilver in the pot. And the fire. Turn the wheel twice. No more, no less. Now grind the sulfur. Carefully.
Is it done? Hmm. Was it so easy then? You have no idea the toll of such a thing. No idea what one must face. Overcome to perform this act of magic. Perhaps not. But still. Enough. It is done. Let us not tarry. Yes. We have our task at Zakarum Keep. Let's finish this. Even for you. I can manage the ritual. If you could do it alone, it would have been done. The fever has broken, at least. Now it's just my hand. My arm. Throbbing. Lorath promises it will get better. <laughs> Hard to believe at the moment. So much has been made of these Haradric arts. I decided to see for myself. I will, unfortunately. And Nerel must also. Donan might have finally got his head on straight, but the Soul Stone is our only weapon against Lilith. I will leave nothing to chance. Speaking for myself, yes, I believe I am. Ready to attune the Soul Stone, at least. As for what comes after, capturing Lilith, keeping her bound in the stone, we know how that's gone in the past. I have to believe it is up to us now. Not to the Prophecy, Inarius, or anyone else. Something is wrong here. Nothing right about this place. Best do this quickly. Yes. Right, Lorat. We will inscribe the six sigils of Dendas in order, then... Follow with the second and fourth reversed. <laughs> it's nice to see you agree on something. Focus. Let us begin. There. Do you feel that? What is it, witch? Someone is coming. It's Elias. He's here. We have to... <clears throat> Loras, don't you dare leave! No, I'll kill him myself. <laughs> the tree demands that you pay. And so do I. I will set your tree afire and cast your corpse upon the flames. I owe no one but the mother.
How many times must we do this before you learn? My life is not yours to claim. I have been to the deepest chambers of the sunken temple, Elias. <laughs> You have no secrets from me. I lost him in the tunnels, but the swamp has him now. Radrim, we were about to finish without you. He's still alive? Where is he? At the end of his bloody trail. This way. You are courting pain and death. Taisa. I need to speak with him. Then do so, Horadrim. Zorath. <coughs> oh, Elias. Was all this worth it then? Truly? I brought Lilith. Thing no one thought possible. And when hell rises to sweep across this world, I should be there beside her, ready to push it back. You left me alone to cross the lines you would dare not attempt. And you have nothing to show for it. You are nothing but a wasted life. Do not look to forgive me, old man, because it is you who brought us here. Was it worth it? That is a coward's question, Lorath. It suits you. Elias of Aronach. Oh, spare me. Of your own free will. You swore an oath to the Tree of Whispers. This is not the life I deserved. <laughs> the Tree does not forget oaths, and it does not forgive debts. It is time to let go. Elias's head hangs from the Tree of Whispers, and your Soul Stone is attuned. This is where I leave you. Leaving? We go to face Lilith. I had hoped you would join us. I know the weight of your reasons, but Lilith remains your concern. Mine lies elsewhere. This is farewell, then. And... Uh... Thank you for the tea. Take care of yourself, Donan. She called me by my name. Lorath won't believe. Where is he? I've not seen him since... since Elias spent his last words. Calling him a coward. And to prove his courage, he what? Rode to face Lilith alone? 
Elias never told us where to find her. But his head is on the Tree of Whispers. So the tree knows where Lilith is going. Lorath could ask, but he'll have to pay the price. What price? The same Elias paid. Eternity on the tree. Brother. No. Get to the tree now! Stop him! Lilith has been two steps ahead of us for far too long. The tree knew where to find her. I asked. Its answer was worth the price. Worth the price? You owe the tree your head. The day you die, you'll be taken to hang here with the others. And what? Did I need your permission? It's done. Put it aside. While we stand here in the mud, Lilith is on her way to absorb Mephisto's power. She has found a gateway to Hell, and she approaches with the key. Where is the gate, brother? Under Chaldeum. Surely there will be some resistance. None. The fools welcomed her in. It is up to us to stop her and imprison her in the Soul Stone. This is all that matters. And if Lilith has already passed through the gate? We follow her into Hell. I will do everything in my power to get us there. The four of us alone? This is lunacy. Not lunacy, child. Duty. We will meet in Tarsarak to prepare. Pray we are not too late. <laughs> <laughs> Strange thing, knowing where you'll go when you die. One less damn mystery to worry about, at least. Did I make the right choice? I did what I had to. We needed answers and we got them. Lilith was poised to storm the very gates of hell. Astaroth and the deal, Rathra and the key, it had all been leading to this. But what we didn't know was that while we were lost in the swamp, Inarius and the cathedral were launching a campaign to strike at Lilith. Their battle would leave the world a wasteland. And whoever won would show no mercy to what was left. Our only hope was to reach Lilith before Inaris. But we couldn't have predicted what happened next. Your silence only damns you further! A cultist shelters here. One of those that set demons upon Chaldeum. The city lies in shambles after what the heretics have done! Lorath and Donan have gone to Chaldeum. The knights march on the city. They felt it best to follow. But I wanted to wait for you. Can I ask you something? Something personal? You know you can. Do you ever feel like nothing you do matters? More than I'd like to admit. They call me a hero, but underneath I'm still the same person I always was. Powerful, sure. Flawed, too. I try, yet my best isn't enough. Not for Yorin, nor your mother. Does it get any easier? It can, with a good ally. <sighs> Thank you, for being honest. It helps, knowing I'm not alone. We should go. I'll find the others in Chaldeum.
thanks. As ready as I can be. But I'm afraid of what we'll find. The Cathedral's out for blood. They're not here to save anyone. It makes you wonder if there's some grain of truth to... Never mind. To what Lilith said. It's not about her. She's making things worse, too. It's just the idea that if the world doesn't change, we'll always be stuck between greater forces that don't care about us and... I don't know. I guess I'm just having doubts. Donan has it. But their plan still strikes me as... misguided. Mephisto is reforming as we speak. If we use the stone on Lilith, we've nothing to fight her father. There must be a better way. It was only a matter of time. After Prava combed the mines, Inarius likely pieced together that Lilith had found the Hell Key. You should hear the knights chant. They're as eager for Hell as she is. Behold, the armpit of the desert. Our families came from Alcarnus years ago after that city went to hell. They camped here by the crossroads, set up trade. It's been a struggle ever since. This one of them? The demon dealers from Galdium. <laughs> Serves him right. I love that locket more than anything. It must be here. Mother's dead. We have to go, damn it. Blessed Akarat, thy light protect us. Thy wisdom guide us. Hush now, dear. I know it hurts, but we need to keep moving. We must have run right back into the night. He was a cobbler for as long as I knew him. Quiet, well liked. Did... Did he really do what the knights said? praying just like us a hollow grab for redemption at the end of a blade a sinner's prayer never reaches the line to work recruit how many cultists have they killed how many innocents What happened here? Murderer! You killed him! You killed him! One tried to make a run for it, sir. Blood from the sky. No mortal magic holds this power. Hang on, brother. Just a bit longer and it'll all be over. Slow down. You die now, you're stuck on the tree with Elias for eternity. Nobody wants that. I was fine on my own. I don't know, but he should be here. It's his army on Crusade. Tears of blood rained on a desert jewel. So speaks the prophecy. 
We are witnessing cosmic history being made. At last, the knights are sacking the place. Is Lilith here? Yes. Just as the tree said, the rain, the Hellspawn, all spew from the Hellgate underneath the city palace. She's opened the way. If she consumes her father's essence, Sanctuary is lost. We can't let that happen. These corpses, displayed so proudly, there's nothing of the light in this. The display is the point. They mean to make an example. Demon worshippers! All of you! Easy now, recruit. Sinners they may be, but cultists they are not. They will face judgment in due time. They harbor the cultist in their home. They claim ignorance. The truth of it remains to be seen. Shot as an ally we have. This rain of blood, the sign we've waited for. They mentioned the Lord of Hatred. Mephisto. What? That can't be. Elias owned this cult, and Lilith owned him. Hmm. Let me do the talking. The time of prophecy has come, knights. Lilith flees to the gate to hell. I will slay her in that cesspit she calls home, and open the way to the heavens. All is as fate decreed. A spear of light, piercing hatred's heart. You who die in battle today, die heavenbound. Rally the troops at the palace. We march. On hell! And after that, your plan? Ah, the Haradrim. Always chasing after the battles of your betters. But the angels don't need you. The stone, Dora. We don't need the bloody angels either. by my blade. Prophecy has foretold it. Same as before. This changes nothing. <sighs> How 
can you say this changes nothing? Our one potential ally just ran off with our one weapon. What's your plan now? To stop Lilith and damn the cost. Inarius is mad with pride. We can't rely on him. Stone or no, there is someone who might stand a chance against Lilith. Me? You bested Astaroth and Andario both. If we can find that stone, you might be our next best weapon. Father! Deliver us! Donin, you've come back to us, and not alone. Blessed be the light. The Father will deliver us, together. He seized our soul stone. His is the will of the light. You still believe that? How can you doubt us? After everything we've done for you and Yorin, at least, he doesn't have to see you like this. Stand down, brethren. Easy. Sin reaps consequence. I have faith the Father acted righteously. We want to stop Lilith. Same as you. Unbelievable. Inarius awaits us at the mouth to hell. Unnecessary. The father will handle Lilith. But your army, your people, they need help. What? As do we. We'll move faster together. Loreth, the voice of reason. Rare pleasure. Very well. You may accompany us to the gate. Hark, knights! The day of prophecy is upon us! The Father will slay Lilith in hell and lift his faithful up to heaven! To the palace!
Locate his bard against us! Hold our position. Lorath, a word, please. We can't trust her. Yes, but they've an army, and we share a goal. For now. Above the gate. Looks like a winch. I'll handle it. On slack. We must have snapped. I need to find another way to the palace. Foul magic hangs about these corpses. The source must be near. have been one. The Haradrim should be at the palace, if they made it. Thank heavens you're here. I convinced them not to go without you. You should have kept your temper with Prava. I know. But you shouldn't have thrown away the stone, either. We have a heading. Mephisto shelters in the Cathedral of Hatred. Across the Sea of Fire, Astaroth's domain. I'd wager that's why Lilith freed him in Skosglen. That's where we'll find her. And what then? We don't have the stone. Enough, Donan! Then it's up to me to stop her. Right. You've been hounding me about this and that non-stop. Can you drop it for once? It's not about me hounding you. It's... Enough! You're both so smart, usually. Usually? Not today. Yes, the stone is gone. Instead of arguing, let's do something about it. If Inarius has it, let's take it back. <laughs> it is the only way to guarantee Lilith's defeat. No, not Lilith. You're all wrong about that. The stone should be saved for Mephisto, her maker, the prime evil. You know his powers of manipulation. His hatred has already poisoned us. Even Lilith fears him. Why don't you? Are you done? <sighs> I am now. Think on what I've said, all right?
I can sense your fear, Father. What did you see? Whether we use you or the stone, we have to stop her. We follow her into hatred itself. It will sour our hearts even more, turn us against each other. Let's remember why we're here. Together. Well done. Yes. Everything feels wrong here. The air, the ground at my feet. Mortals were not meant to tread this realm. The sooner we can find Lilith and get out, the better. Dispel the flames. Tani Sokdailekit. Demons! Help us fight them off! Tani Sokdailekitos. Impressed? This is where the proper battle was fought. They didn't stand a chance. Fodder for a broken angel's ambitions. Keep moving. Beget sins as men beget men, terror begets hate as hate begets destruction, destruction begets terror as terror begets hate as hate begets destruction. Well done. is not over. The father is hunting lilies. In the spire. Across this infernal wasteland. 
Salvation is coming. Not for these knights you led to hell. Not for you either. Brother. You're just a tool of someone who doesn't give a damn about any of us. And a thief. You had the stone the whole time we were helping you in Chaldeum, didn't you? Inarius entrusted it to me, and... Wait, wait... You... took it? Insolent heretic! Servants of darkness! You will all be damned! Leave her. She's poisoned with hatred. Is she the only one? Remember why we're here. What we're fighting against. What do you propose? I have a tonic. A little something to numb the pain and get her moving. Drink up, Brava. If you're wise, you'll get back to Chaldeum while you still have a chance. Farewell. I... I keep seeing myself standing over Lilith, stabbing her. I can't seem to push the thought away. The hatred here is trying to worm its way into my mind. Anger got the better of me there. My head's clear now, though. He was imprisoned here for millennia. He knows the terrain better than any of us. Yes, but keep your guard up. The cathedral is in shambles. We're on our own now. Stick together and find that spire Priva spoke of. Watch out! Something's bombarding us! It's coming from the high ground! Help me put up the bulwark! It's so long. The bombs of power in hell will be overturned. This is not over yet. I will draw out your suffering. I'm surprised you still remember the words to the bulwark. I'm the one who taught you that spell. More of this damn hellfire. I'll clear the way. Tani sub thy lekitos. Heed my call, Karu. Some allies in hell. Not for long. Let's find another route. All hail, Lilith! Queen of hatred! Under the barrier, quickly!
You know, you're not half bad at taking charge, Don. I can see why you were that big man in Scotland. Was that a compliment? Someone, write this down. Memorialize the moment. It's not like I haven't given you one before. There was you know, that other time. Oh yes, I. Re uh, oh, uh, the ground is shifting. Prepare yourselves. Impressive. I need more time. In my breath. I see the spire up ahead. Come on.
May we fight true in his holy name. Do you remember them, Anarius? The whispers of the damned. Words will not save you. Show yourself. So, the soldier returns. And with such purpose. No longer the conflicted soul I left behind. You deceived me! <laughs> Created. Sanctuary is an abomination! And our son. I made it right. To satisfy the heavens. Tell me. Did they rejoice? No, they do not want you. Silent. 
is their judgment. But would I set things right? What more would you have me do? Tell me! Please! Tell me! The heavens do not speak to you anymore. Heavens, protect me! No, you belong in hell. What happened? Lilith. She tore off Inarius' wings. It was like she was toying with him. She wanted the angel to suffer before she ended him. Then the prophecy was wrong. A spear of light piercing hatred's heart. Maybe not. Lilith is wounded too. If she's hurt, it will be easier to trap her in the Soul Stone. We cannot stop. She's already gone. What's now? I have an idea. I will prepare the sightless eye. The eye? What do you mean? We must find Lilith. The only way to do that is to use the eye. Are you serious? I know what happened the last time the eye was used. I know it didn't end well. Do you have a better idea? Any of you? That's what I thought. is right. The eye is the only advantage we have, the only way to find Lilith. There is no time to waste.
at last. To collect your safe passage to the Cathedral of Hatred. And you look less well than when I saw you last. I would not be so certain of victory. Fulfill the promise you made to me. Of course, daughter of hatred. With my gift, you will face your father. We all return home in the end. know the truth. My 
son, who is wiser than even the Haradrim. But it was not in his nature to be a shepherd either. His prophecy was a warning. But rather than use it to unite the sanctuary, he let it breed chaos. Minarius, Elias, Lorath. They wanted so badly to see their own meaning in the prophecy. They were blind to the simple truth of it. We are prisoners of the eternal conflict. The pawns of angels and demons. It will always be a part of us. We must fight to survive. It was so human of Anarius to think the prophecy was all about him. Or perhaps your kind inherited that vanity from him. Listen. your hand. Then this is the future that awaits you. Why do you keep helping me? Look where we stand. I saved you in this dismal little cave. Because I sensed you could end Lilith. And that is all I want. 
I won't lie. There will come a time when we are enemies. But like it or not, right now we need each other to defeat her. Look me in the eye. I don't serve
Don't even think of burying me here, you bastard. I'm too damn old to hold your body out of hell. So move your hand. Let me see. I haven't taken orders from you in years, Lorit. I see no reason to start now. You should have come to me instead of the cathedral. I would have shown up for you. Shared your burden. I know. And perhaps things would have gone differently with Scott's claim. And with your end. Was it enough? Will he think it was enough? Yes. More than enough. I'm sorry about Donan. What's done is done. What... What did you learn from the eye? Lilith tried to trap me. Before that, I saw her cross a great sea of fire. Beyond it lay her father's domain. We... are too late. We can't give up now. We have the stone. What should we do? I, I don't know. I, I, I always thought if I didn't survive, you'd be the one to finish this. You've always had the steady hand, not me. Trust your gut. Is the reason we've made it this far. I apologize. Time for our roads to part. Farewell. He gave everything, his home, his son. What was it for? No. Mephisto. You trusted a prime evil? Trust had no part in it. Your friend saw reason instead. As should you. If Lilith takes my essence, Sanctuary is lost. What do you propose? No proposals. I offer only my aid. This leads to the Cathedral of Hatred. But you must hurry. Lilith is almost there. You 
you've arrived before Lilith, but she is close. What now? We can set an ambush. I distract her, you trap her in the soul stone. Yes, a wise ploy. And you can leave the stone with me. I will ensure that Lilith never troubles your world again. You return home. I remain in hell. All as it should be. Something isn't right. Mephisto led you to this moment. We're in his realm. Should we really be doing what he wants? Between him and Lilith, he is the greater evil. You want to use the stone on him? Think carefully. That path would lead to failure for all of us. He's afraid. It could work. We imprison Mephisto in the stone. Get back to Lorath. Then we seal the gates of hell behind us and leave Lilith here. She'll catch you before you escape. And if I'm trapped in the stone when she does, she will take my power. Don't let your hate for me blind you to common sense. Nerel, I can't trust my thoughts about Mephisto, but I trust yours. Do what you think is right. Your lives and those of all humanity depend on what you do next. Choose wisely. And we'll wait for you at the chapel. This better not be the last time I see you. Understand?
was meant as an escape from the eternal conflict. And yet, here we are, again. I gave you free will, and you've squandered it, wasting it on a crusade you don't understand. You chose tyranny when offered freedom, a poor legacy for my gift. Without me, you would have no victory. And its cost will be more than you can pay. I'm impressed. Time for our roads to part. It is done. Lilith is no more. Is she trapped in the stone? No. Mephisto is. He helped us reach the Cathedral of Hatred before Lilith did. Uh, of course. He had a hand in all of this from the beginning, didn't he? We had to take the risk. No. I understand. Where is the stone? Nairel. She didn't come back to you? No. She must have already gone ahead to the desert chapel. We'll go after her. Quickly. I... I need to bring Don in and seal the gate to hell behind us. I will... will only slow you down. You can't do this on your own, my friend. We came together. We leave together, too. Now... We are truly alone. The creators of Sanctuary, Angel and Demon, Father and Mother, are dead. They made us in their image. Their conflict is a part of us. It always will be. But is there any truth to Lilith's vision? This mad idea that we can escape the eternal conflict? These are not questions befitting an old man. I don't have much time left. This struggle is not mine anymore. Or will we walk the same path of all children who rebel against their parents? So often we simply become them. All I can do is help the Wanderer and Nairel avoid the fate of Rathma. And everyone else who tried and failed to overcome our flawed nature. Once we are back with Nairel, we will find a way. We have to.
Rest, girl, while you can. We'll be on the move again soon. She's gone. Why didn't you wait for us? No. It will take time for the corruption to spread from the stone. She must have left for a reason. Yes. Yes, that must be right. Yorin. Donan. We've lost so many to hatred. We can't lose Nerel too. Come on. Norathnar! Will this never end? Yosef, what do you want? Step aside. I'm here for the Haradrim. Can it wait? I'm off to bury a friend. We'll dig his grave for you. Oh, that's kind. But who will dig yours? <gasps> Kill the heretic! <laughs> The Haradrim have used their dark magics to bear a great evil into our world. Commit their wicked souls to the Father and retrieve the Soul Stone. Joseph. He saved my life in Nevesk. They were not our enemies. Oh, they were fools. I don't have the time for it. I am going to Scotsclan. Donan deserves to be buried with his son. I thought the dead deserved nothing while the living are in danger. <laughs> Wise words. But I... I have a promise to keep. That's why you must ride north, ahead of me. If the cathedral doesn't have her yet, Nayrell might head for the vault. Find her. Once you're together, meet me at Donald's estate. Well done. This is what I saw in the reflections. We're close. I can save you from this, Mother. I promise. I can learn how to... <laughs> You're going to leave me, aren't you? You'll find a place where I can be taken care of.
Not what I expected. But let's not give up hope. I thought you'd know me better by now. I am my mother's daughter. Where there's a lead, there's a way. And I'll follow it to the end. No sign of her. But that letter wasn't here before. She must have left it. Why do I only hear one set of footsteps? I spent a lot of time learning this code, so I hope you remember how to read it, Lorath. Because you are the last Horadrim now. My mother would have wanted me to stay with you. She believed the Horadrim had all the answers. I don't know if she'd recognize this person I'm becoming. Hard for me to think about her right now. But then I remember you and Donan. You weren't all knowing Haradrim. You were bitter. You were uncertain. But you were always true friends. That's what I hold on to, because there is so much further to go. Your imperfection gave me hope, and we will need it to face what comes next. To face him and his brothers. I don't know how much time I have, but there has to be a better answer, and I have to find it. Alone. I know he'll want to go with me, but people have already died because I was not careful enough. I can't risk you too. 
If I've misjudged, the world is going to need you to survive and clean up the mistakes I leave behind. I know you don't want to hear this, but you don't get to quit. Not again. Wish me well, Morath. Because if everything works out as I am hoping, we will never see each other again. Both Inarius and Lilith have perished in Hell. I couldn't begin to guess what that means for Sanctuary. There's no telling what creatures or phenomena might bleed from Hell. Closed gate or no. Something nasty knowing our luck. I just hope you're still with us then. Releasing Mephisto from Hell is going to have consequences beyond our current understanding. But that was not my choice to make. It was yours. Whatever the road ahead, I am with you, my friend. I wish we could. She's out there with a prime evil, but we've been instructed not to follow. We wouldn't even know where to start searching if we did. So, until we know more, we'll have to wait. I can't just sit idly by waiting for word. No? Then what are you gonna do? Go after her against her will? No. You're right about Nayrel, friend. But there's still work to be done in Sanctuary. I'm going to the Tree of Whispers. Why would you do that? Because it might be our only ally left. And we may soon need allies more than ever. Fine. Go see the tree. But be very careful. Welcome, Saviour. You've stopped Lilith, freed sanctuary of its supposed shackles. I'm sure it's everything you were hoping for. 
Congratulations. Ugh, shut up, Rex! Always so talkative, new flesh. Wanderer, why are you here? Come to strike a deal? My head stays where it is. I'm simply looking for an ally. Ally? <laughs> we might be able to form an arrangement. If it's not too beneath you. Debts need to be fulfilled. You could claim them. Yes, claim their debts. In exchange, we will provide you with power, wealth, whatever it is you desire. Yes, yes. yes. Meanwhile, you will be the force of good, curing sanctuary of its ailments. Far away in the broken city of Chaldeum, there are those indebted to us, demon and man alike. Slay them and claim their debts. The crow will do the rest. Well, Darn, you've made the world just a bit better. There are many like him, and more to come still. But do not waste time. Those we find can be lost again. For now, we will sleep. If only to be spared from the babbling! Too many words... Farewell. Time for our roads to part. Thank you.